What's the crack? Welcome back, your boy Simo Sim Car Simmer Frame, aka the real Sim Shady. I'm Monkfish, hope you're all doing well. We're here now without Gary this week. Yeah, thanks Gary for coming. The boxing little. The boxing world, there's loads yeah. going on. Even Irish boxing alone. Like. Yeah. There's loads of beef. There's a few beefs in the Irish boxing though as well. I, yeah. that I've noticed myself. Dylan Moran Dylan and Moore, fucking Simo. Paddy, fucking Donovan. Yeah. I was always texting him saying why don't we get Paddy because we had Dylan on before yeah and I said to him why don't we get Paddy on like down the line and see what started yeah, the beef the story <laughs> that'd be gas yeah. Yeah. yeah they're looking at making that this year I heard yeah that fight I, yeah I don't think they, would you say Dylan take the fight I don't know like who would you who would you think's a better boxer Paddy wins all day like. he's a good boxer yeah Paddy's class he's good he's world class yeah. let's get into you though let's see I want to hit your last yeah. fight man that knockout man is Unreal. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that was sparked, uh, man. Oh, that fall, was fucking... You can't beat that. Get falling into the ropes out of the fucking hell. Man. Do you know when it, it it makes it ten times better when they actually get up and try like try yeah, and the ref has to stop. Yeah, gone. Yeah, 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 yeah like yeah, Bambi. Yeah, it's dirty man. That's, that's why is that the, feeling like? Why is that happened? Yeah, why is that happened? Katachi Cup in the WBO European. Uh, that was back in what? Back in lockdown, twenty twenty one. He was the same. I don't know if you've seen that video. He's, he tried to get up and fell on his face and all. Like, <laughs> if it was on your TikTok around, I've definitely it's seen it. It's on my TikTok, yeah. yeah. So it makes it show him because he probably didn't see it. No? I think I, I started following you back around lockdown. That's where I came. Was it, yeah? yeah. Around, that's where I've noticed it. Was it? I said it to him a few times to try and get you on. Yeah. But uh, now that you're just in the public really big time now, especially with the match room. Well, the, the, people always said to me that it's like, it happens like that, like, and when it does, when it does start rolling, it just goes so quick. It's, what's the noticed, snowball effect? Yeah, like, I've Big noticed, time. and they always say, like, oh, it takes a lifetime of hard work to be overnight like, success or whatever. But I've noticed it, like, the last, since, not even the, not even the Conlon fight, like, I fought in on that Conlon Wood card back in last yeah. March against Vasquez, but only since I got signed with Macho in August, there was a bit of hype around that, and then obviously I had my debut in October. Yeah. Put that, uh, Performance in that knockout push round. Sleep time. Since then, it's just went like, <laughs> major. Yeah. It's mad how it works, though. Like, isn't it? Like, it's it's not to say that one thing could change your life, but this is a build up. But there's when you'd sign into the match room, boxing, and then there was such a big platform, especially Eddie Hearn. Like, it's he's the such platform. a like. I was putting in performances like that, like oh, three, four years ago. Amateur as well. Like, like, three, four years ago, I won the Irish title. Went up to Belfast, fought a fella um, from Belfast, Joe Fitzpatrick, first round knockout as well. Sort all his fans up there, like um, <laughs> beating the homeboy, you know, beating the homeboy up there. But that was like that was massive for me back then. But like you get no, nobody really knows about yeah, that because I've only come on the scene the last. Yeah, yeah, it's really social media, isn't it? Like it's massive as well. Like you could be doing savage and not being on telly or much like that in the backgrounds and being deadly if cunts but if you're not in the public eye 100% it doesn't and then you count see, basically you get <laughs> some fellas who are actually really good at social media then yeah. but they that might not scrap. be the best boxer like, do you know what I mean yeah. but uh, that probably goes with a lot of sports is there right? any uh, is there any examples though is, is there that's a problem that's like a Jake proper Paul is number one it? example isn't he do you like, think do you know he's a mean? bad boxer though I actually I, do you think he's I a bad boxer I consider Jake Paul as a boxer <laughs> So do I, I. Like before, I, he was a YouTuber who boxed. Now I consider him but as a boxer. But I think what Conor McGregor said is perfect. It's a genre of boxing. Yeah. That misfits, the KSI and stuff like that. The YouTube boxing, it's not like mainstream boxing. It's well, a until, whole different thing, I un, think. Until you jump in the, in the rankings and start fighting ranked opponents. Yeah, exactly. And start trying to win belts and all. Then, right, then you're... I, I, don't, yeah. I don't see them going that way. What's he in though? He joined something, didn't he? Yeah, he's in a That's PFL. That's MMA now or something. MMA, that, yeah, because it? it's a two-part uh, deal. He's trying to fight so many, Nate Diaz in a boxing. It's and only then, boxing, isn't it? And then he goes into MMA or something, wasn't no, he? You saying? He, yeah, so the, the, so the, the deal... So many boxing fights and then MMA. He wants to do one fight... Boxing and one fight MMA against Nate Diaz. Both, both against Nate Diaz. Yeah, that'd be Fuck madness. Nate Diaz, kill him Nate Nate Diaz would <laughs> slaughter him man in a MMA fight. Yeah, Lord, like, that's. Do you know what fair fucks from doing it? Yeah, you, you have to get in that set ring, boys. And he's stepping up and he's starting. How do you go from doing fucking PlayStation on YouTube or whatever he started off? Who, Jake to, Paul, yeah. Disney boy, he's Disney, Disney as well. Was he Disney? Yeah, yeah. Was Disney to go and get bizarre, him. bizarre Zach or something. It was How do you go from Disney man into that? Do you know what always amazes me about him? Like <coughs> the money that they're dealing with. Like he's oh. there talking about like 
tens and twenties and millions. Of this. <laughs> 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 like, yeah, offering pa- Paddy the Baddy Bad a million a quid million, just, to just, to, just to spar him, just to fly out and spar him. Like, do you know and, what I mean? and he didn't take it, though, did he? No, that was a mad one as well. He wasn't didn't it? take it. Yeah, Would you yeah. take it though? I'd fly over in the morning yeah. to spar him. Yeah, I'm going now. Hold on, I'm finishing wait. this podcast yeah. first. I reckon, <laughs> <I'd> reckon <laughs> I'd hold it like that and I would be knocked out. <laughs> 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 standing him. in the corner like this. Nah, you'd, I reckon he'd, he just has that like loop and overhand right, doesn't he's he? He's explosive like, isn't he? He yeah, does punch he is. a bit. But it's a fair out for fucking YouTubers. No, he's but yeah, well, he's not a YouTuber now, man. Yeah, well, not anymore. anymore. Oh, he's, he's, he's like anymore. he is hun- but twenty four seven well train. Yeah, he's fair. yeah, chaos, but chaos. Like he's fair. Well, he's a YouTuber. Yeah, but he's he he's YouTuber. he's not fighting types of people that Jake Paul's fighting. If you get me. Yeah, true. Like, really. He commented on one of my on a video that Did some he, yeah? boxing page shared to me last week on the page with a load of laughing faces. I only seen it about an hour ago. Did you? KSO, you clown. KSO, did he? Stupid cunt. Yes. KSO, you don't be dissing the boy, yeah? Telling you. Telling you. Fly him over and let him spy you. Yeah, you won't take that hand. You won't take that left hand. I'm telling you now, KSO, you won't take yeah. the left hand off, Curry. Not bother. I don't think so. Anyway. No, be it sleep, sleep town. This way, what yeah, way yeah. is he actually? I say he would he be I what mean. your um I, I at sixty one point two kilos. And yeah. what are you six one? Six You're taller two. than me, are you? I'm taller than you. Am I taller than you? I'm as tall as yeah. you. You're taller than me. Taller, than taller, yeah. And you, you can get down to what? Sixty one point two is what I put. Yeah. I have some, I have something like that wrote down my notes. I wanted to ask you, like, how, like, boys, how are you? That what were you eating? Yeah, weight cutting. Like, how do you get that? That's the one thing that people actually can't get their head around about me. Like, is like, how is he making that weight? And then it used to be a case of obviously the last few fights have been knocking people out, so people are starting to see what it used to be. Ah. He's just tall and skinny, so just get in close to him and yeah, find the new and do this and do yeah, that. And then we, used to, we used to always go, right, cool, let them get in close then, right, fight them two or three rounds at long distance and let them get in close and let them see what's going to be like in close as well. And then after they get in close, they're like, fuck, what do I do in here? And then they're like a fish on the ground and two minutes <laughs> later, then exactly. flopping yeah. around for a fire. I've always been skinny though. That's, I don't know. Tall and it's skinny. It's just like, high metabolism. I used to be slagged, like growing up 14, 15, like a oh, fucking scrawny little this and that. Do you know what I mean? String but, of piss and all that crack. Until all you got the left hand up. And blah, blah, blah. But like, I'm still scrawny now, but. Power. But they yeah, wouldn't say it now, though. They wouldn't say it now, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> but like, yeah, how long are you in it? How long are you doing boxing? I'm Obviously, boxing since, since young, are you? Six, yeah. So, so we can go back to the start, so. will we? Lord, 20 six. years. Yeah. And where oh were you fighting over, boys. like an amateur? Like, where, like, what was your club I, starting up? I joined, so my brother joined just before me. I have an older brother. He's two years older than me. I would have been like, I was the one always the one the road that was like giving me my trouble. Like he was okay. he's the quieter brother, yeah, yeah. you know what I mean? And is he fighting professional or anything like that? No, he Just gave it China. up around sixteen, seventeen. Um but I would have been always the one that was fucking causing trouble, like yeah. you know what I mean? Um and then we were close, like and he he went then the the boxing club was training two days a week. So he used to he joined the boxing club and used to be gone then for two hours, two days a week, and I was like, Where is he gone? Like yeah, she yeah. wouldn't tell me for ages. And then she, eventually she brought me down because I wasn't old enough. She brought me down and she knew the coach and uh, he was just like... Yeah, Where was that? Of? Nice boxing club. Nice. It was down in uh, it was down in Nice Parishall at the time. So it was like a, a little... A community centre. A little was community centre beside the beside the church in Nice. And it right. used to... See, if there was heavy rain around, the, there was carpets on the floor. It used to flood and all. <laughs> flood and and we used to share it with karate, taekwondo. There was Irish dancing in there at one stage. There was like... So we had, there was two bikes... There was only two bags and we had to put up the bags. We'd go in at half six every night. No way. Put up the bags with two strings, like two big uh, industrial strings and then... Straps. Take the straps, sorry, yeah. yeah, and then take them down every evening, like twice a week. No way. Uh, I remember that back in the day when the fucking uh, in Pajo Highlands Boxing Club, he was at the, it was in the old Thomas School and he was just oh, hanging yeah. them from the beam, so on chains and taking them Basically off. Basically, same, yeah, same thing. We were sharing them, so like after us, like we had the... the Parish all from seven to nine, say like quarter to nine. You have the crowd, lads, like outside waiting. To yeah, ready, and warm up and dressed and all, ready yeah. to get in and go in yeah. that gears and all stuff like that. That's like when we do the hall ball, isn't it? Yeah, people all are the taekwondo boys. You see the them door, opening the door, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's, what we That's fucking mad. I remember starting like I was. So everybody w- in the club at that time would have been like, my brother would have been one of the youngest. He's two years older than me. I was six. 
he would have been about eight, nine. They said, yeah, you were eight to start. You had to be yeah. eight to start. But I remember being, I was so small that I had to spar the lads and hit them and the, hit their jock straps. Like, the lads had to yeah, their jock you, straps yeah. and I'd be sparring them, hitting their jock straps because it'd be so big. Like. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. So, so yeah, you, you were a small lad, lad anyway. So you're small and now you're about seven foot. Small and then I just fucking hit first year and just show. Yeah, we missed that part. Yeah. I, was, I just <laughs> no, I, I, part. I, I was tiny as well up till I was nineteen. I was oh, yeah. five foot six. And you're about six two now. Six Damn, one. Just six one. Six, six one. one I'd say six one. Yeah, we let you away. I'm six, six one. one. Yeah, people. <laughs> six one. Yeah, yeah with six the ninety fives on, I'm six two. <laughs> 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 12 for you, isn't it? Fuck's sake. Why am I only bleeding 5'7? Ah, you're 5'12, eh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm 6 foot with heels on. <laughs> so you wear heels on, dude. Certainly. Yeah, I'm just sorry. But what it's I was saying God. about the weight cutting, I have a few little bits here that I wanted to ask you about the weight cutting. The weight cutting is made, because though, isn't it? Like, it's heavy. Oh, it's it's heavy, is it? My weight cuts are. Oh, well, obviously, like you were saying, you are always like skinny enough, but. No, but like. Now a fight at sixty one point two is that's championship weight. If you're fighting for a title, you have to fight. You have to make one hundred and thirty five pounds. It's sixty one point two. My last couple of fights have been at one hundred and thirty seven because they haven't been for belts. So you can uh, fight a little bit above championship weight right, right, right. at sixty two and a half. Then right. so KG. But if a big KG, fight, you yeah, have to hit. It. If it's a big fight for a title, then you have to hit one three five. But, Would it be hard for you to hit that? Uh, my last fight at one three five was. Yeah, it would have been Katachikov. It's two pounds. It's an extra kilo. I walk around. So what's probably, this? So sixty-two. If I go on the scales now, I'm sixty-eight kilos. Sixty-eight. Yeah. I'm eighty-eight point nine. Eighty-eight point nine. That's the heaviest I've ever been in my life. Let's. Yeah, I I hit uh, seventy after my last fight there. I came back to the gym and I hit seventy, and it was the first time I ever seen seventy, 70. on the scales. That is mad. I was it? Uh, what I was doing we, last year, I was doing uh, like a charity boxing match. I've like, seen that on your page. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was trying to get down because your man was smaller than me. Like, you were never going to get down to that. Anyways. But I was he trying the hardest. He was, was fucking 60 was something, wasn't he? <laughs> 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 he was 60 something. He was 60 something. Yeah, no, but I got it. He was, he's my height. <laughs> yeah, but listen. He's, and he's 60 something. Yeah, 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 he's yeah. the fourth <laughs> round, man. No, I better just say, man, your man just stood there like that down for the whole time. You know what I'm trying to get at? The weight cutting part, I got down to 84 kg. But I couldn't get any. I couldn't go any further. Yeah. I couldn't get down anymore, man. And what did you start at around eighty eight? Yeah. No, I start. I say it was around eighty six. So you I couldn't try down that far. <laughs> I was fast, and all I was. Yeah. I was fast and trained like a tramp, going down to boxing train with bleeding bags on me, sink. Oh, what's it called? Cling film and all on me, jogging yeah. like a mad tramp. But, but that only gets the water. You see, as soon as you go home, then drink a bottle of water. Back, back in, yeah. on you, like, you know That's what, I mean? what that is. Yeah. yeah. And it's uh, you're eating as well, and like yeah, your food is. The main thing. It's the main thing. You can't. They, Pete always says you can't do train a bad diet. And it's so true. Like, so would true. you have someone doing your meals for you? Or are you the your prepper? No, I mean, I, I prep my own meals, but I have a nutritionist who does my weight cuts. Somebody who looks after my weight cuts. Right. Dave Nolan, Synapse Performance is is uh, his thing. He's a uh, like he'll come on board. He'll give me a show four weeks out for my fight. Right, watch your weight now. Right, cool. This is what you have to be going into say 10 days out this is what you have to be yeah. and then the week before your fight this is what you have to be and then the week before he'll tell me you drink this much water you, this is what you eat this is what you do blah 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 and then I'll wait like what he'll have like checklist yeah, this, and is, what, this is in around what you should be on this day this day this day That's and I wake up like to the ground what he tells me I'm gonna be like that is mad and he's always like because we do water loads now yeah and he's been like the last couple of like Four days out from away, and you could be going to bed, and you could be five, six kilos overweight because you're after drinking so much water, eight liters of water. That day. And what would you do then for like? I see, I know people do like say saunas and stuff like that, and sauna suits, and I seen videos like a paddy with body on the ground with loads of towels over them and all. Is that the way you do it as well? I haven't had to do that yet, thank like thankfully, but hopefully I won't have to do it. Yeah, because um, I used to do it as an amateur. Right. But since I got Dave on board, we've done like I do a water water load. So you build yourself a loads of water. I drink loads it. and loads yeah. of water. Um, your your hormone 
that tells you that you need to piss it turns on really quickly yeah so if you're drinking loads and loads of water you yeah. have to constantly go to the toilet it's hard to drink loads of water though isn't it oh man it's you're tough like, yeah, drink yeah, nine, liters, myself. nine liters would you day. get to nine, nine liters? liters nine liters has been the highest I've I think got. I've only got to nine, nine liters boys two that's and a half a liters yeah that's how's like, that around six of them Six of them a day. How would you even drink that? Well, You'd have to force it. Yeah, it's forced. Of course, yeah, you're yeah, forcing, forcing it. it. Like, but it's only for three days. And then on the fourth day, you cut it. It's only for three days. Oh, yeah, you drown yourself now, for three would days. You, if you just water, would it? I, I would still be eating, like. Just um, fruits. Like, <laughs> fruits and yogurts. Peanut <laughs> butters, oils, like all stuff that's uh, that's low in. It's not that bulky, like, do yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? It's, it has calories for energy, but it's like, it, like you eat that much peanut butter, you're talking like that much peanut butter is 100 calories, probably. Yeah, I used to be into it until I started using it for weight cuts. But hey, peanut like, butter. Don't put peanut butter near me again. Yeah, sc- what would your cheat That's meal be like? Nando's. I'm only out to come from Nando's. Oh, yeah. yeah. The square, yeah. yeah. I was actually nearly late because every time I go to the fucking square, I get lost. <laughs> As the people say, you go to the square and you walk around the circus. Honestly, God, yeah. <laughs> well, it was in Nando's there in the square. Oh, Nando. Oh, boys, Nando's is. Cr- you can't beat the halloumi sticks. I don't think you can beat Nando's. Like, people write to me, oh, it's just chicken, though. I'm like, it's, nah, it's not good. just it's chicken. It's good chicken, though. Chicken. That halloumi, you know halloumi sticks. Yeah, yeah. He put me onto them. He was oh, trying to the chili, oh, chili dip. Oh, that chili sauce is unreal. Chili jam. Chili jam. Is, yeah. It's That's one. banging, isn't it? Yeah. What's your meal in plat in? He slags me all the time about man. Oh, he always gives me grief, but I just get the medium butterfly you chicken. Tell him. I want to fuck it. All right, go on, tell him. <laughs> medium butterfly chicken. Yeah. Double party chips. Yeah. And a bottomless drink, and then a plate of fucking uh, what's it called? Halloumi chi- halloumi sticks with the jam. That's all right. But yeah, that's I don't get any sauces around. I use ketchup. Oh, my sauce. Ketchup, it? <laughs> so yeah. Oh, my God. It's t- I'd be going out to, like, see if you're in, like, we were in SDK in Florida last year, like, and yeah, she's calling the waiter over at Where's your ketchup? ketchup where's the red sauce? sauce. <laughs> 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 no, stuff like that, I'll get barbecue sauce. sauce. Can I have some red sauce on my caviar, sauce please? Barbecue sauce for special occasions. <laughs> yeah, barbecue <laughs> sauce. <laughs> sauce. <laughs> Sitting there eating caviar, yeah, can I have a bit of red sauce, I know, but see, like, I wouldn't be eating caviar, man. You'd be using the barbecue it. sauce for that, and anyway, wouldn't yeah, bar- you? Would love to try that. Did you ever see caviar? It's mad looking, isn't it? What? Yeah. It's fish eggs. Fish, fish eggs, 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 yeah. It's fi- fermented fish couldn't eggs. Couldn't be nice. I don't think so. I like fish, but... Yeah, same, fish. but... I like, I like haddock. Nice. I like haddock. I like fish. I like fish. Smell cod out of the chipper. I love smell yeah, cod. No, like, like if without all the chipper stuff, if you're mad or something. Like, haddock. Yeah. Just haddock. Haddock. Yeah. haddock. Yeah. Just haddock on the plate. Nothing else. Just bare haddock. haddock. Oh, Fish and rice cake. Did you ever see that video? <laughs> yeah. You see the size of him now? He's a monster fishing a rice cake. <laughs> and I, I, on a Wednesday, I'll have fish and rice cake. Uh, I'll wake up and i have fish and rice cake. What a video, boys. But here, I jump into... Uh, I know we were yapping a bit about earlier and we were only half started, but... You're out there swinging. and... There's loads before that. I, I know, know, but let's just talk about that. You're out there swinging and you're a nice little deal. Match room, yeah. Match room. Yeah, How did it all come box. about? How did it all come about? Like, background stuff. How did that all come about? Yeah, like, how like, did you meet with... That's been... A long, long time ago. I fought on a matchroom show. Just got the opportunity to fight on a matchroom show. My second pro fight yeah. in Belfast. And I ended up being fought on opening the show at four o'clock. Um, and text Eddie Hearn saying, hey, like, I think he's, I he's a promoter, this. so he's not going to come until the main event. Is yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? So I text him saying, I'm opening the show. I want to impress you. Come down and have a look. And, uh, Did he come? And he ended up coming down, yeah. And seeing me fight, but that was my second fight. That's probably like four and a half years ago. And ever since then, I've been in interviews. Now I always say, like that's where I seen my career going was match him. I think he's the best. I think what he's doing, I, I like what he's doing. Um, he's the only one that's going global as well with it. Like yeah, Frank Warren is in, he's in um in UK top ranker in America. But Eddie's trying to take. Well, I think he's doing. I think he went the smart way about things of getting involved with. The likes of KSO and Jake Paul and all them as well. Yeah, I think... For social media was... I think it was going to happen anyway, wasn't yeah. it? So he was just the first one to jump on it and do yeah, that, like... Exactly, yeah. Um, And he's a funny bastard. He's yeah. a funny cunt you from the videos. Like, like, what is he like in person? Like, I've only met... Like, I've met Eddie a couple of times, but I've only sat down oh, like yeah, this yeah. with him once. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, 
but like he, he's a hundred percent like he's very it seems to me as if he's very honest like as well yeah. do you know what I mean he tells you how it is this is what just the plans we have for you this is what we think we can do and um, this big play, I, I see the the one in March is it May May is that is that going to be in Crow Park yeah really yeah is it is that like, confirmed not confirmed I don't think but like everything I'm seeing is like like RT have mad. started putting out stuff now that, I mean? and that was like it was so it must be l- so it must be a little have, background uh, Matt Jones posted on Instagram maybe <coughs> 10 days ago you have to get to a certain point of of negotiations before you start posting about uh, it out there and all you know as in the Crow Park that's in magic Crow Park, and that was only like 6 months ago or a year ago people were like Throwing that out there because he wanted Katie like, Taylor you know I mean? there, didn't he? Yeah, at Serrano. Yeah, and but it's just like a bit. Of, it was like an idea back then. Like, do you know what I mean? You're going, ah, yeah, Croke Park. Yeah, that that'd be deadly to fight him. But now it's a, it's fucking because it's to happen. Like, oh, I remember the big thing was uh, they wanted Conor McGregor to do Croke Park, but I think since he's not in it, like it's bo- everyone's focus now on boxing instead of the UFC and MMA and stuff like that. I yeah, think no, MMA is yeah. kind of falling off I a little bit. I think MMA only came up because of him, really. Yeah, true, yeah. Like, I always watched it before him, but it exploded when McGregor went on yeah. just because the way he goes on. like He's just so a polarizing character, like, isn't he? Like, he's, uh, he's one of a kind, for he sure. Is one of, I love his Twitters. I love his Twitter's voice clips. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I follow that page on TikTok. <laughs> oh, they're the funniest. <laughs> Was well, how's he get away with it? I don't even like. I'm like, yeah, I, I don't always be <laughs> listening to him going like, if I had that money and that much success, I'd just delete me Twitter. Like, I would have just disappeared for a while. Like, just just like, but you know see what? See that you're posting on Instagram. Get on that and just say. Get away. on it. Why are you so? Just away. Why do you want to just, just go just, out for it? Because <laughs> you just he's just like us. That's why he's, yeah, he's no, just it's, like a normal it's Joe. Just so like handing us fucking billions fucking <laughs> and just saying go on. With five hundred million in the bank, yeah. In fairness, yeah, we'd still be on people's TikTok lives and all, giving it large. Yeah, definitely. It's still giving it loads on Twitter and all that, wouldn't you? I say. He'd be back in the boxing ring. I'd say he will. He definitely. He's definitely fight again, and anyway, won't he? Yeah. Whether it's UFC, like or... supposedly Floyd Mayweather is going to be fighting in uh, February in UK. Yeah, I seen that. I, seen so I think he might that. be doing so, so, like he fought Denji, like some YouTuber that's correct. He's that. making millions. Case, isn't case he, so is that who your man is, Daisy? Yeah. yeah? Okay, so is it, bro? Yeah, and he's can't, he can't box fucking eggs. They're making some pound, aren't they, through all that? Madness, madness. You see people like a lot of people in the boxing industry. Got kind of pissed off at it for a while. Both but I think it's more like empty. jealousy, like because yeah. I've heard people say, "Oh, followers don't make you money or fuck," but like but they do, they do. Like now, this day, say they six, days. say five years, not even three years ago, maybe five years ago. Yeah, it doesn't count. But now it's all about it's what's huge. your profile look like, what's your following count, what's your uh, look at interactions. Hundred like. percent. Do you think he can box? No, not at all. Do you know? I don't think so. I've seen a couple of his fights. Maybe he might come out and surprise me in the next fight. But like, oh do you see God. how much Jake Paul offered him to fight? Two point one million. Did he? Yeah. Oh Lord, but and why does he keep throwing it down? Is he afraid he's actually going to put up an Instagram there today saying he's fighting for free? Just that's all just he says. It's funny he fumbles. Funny, isn't it? I love it all the back and forth, man. It's good. <laughs> Is that like is that what he's doing? Is that what he's putting out? Because he's obviously afraid that he lose to. Yeah, but just see what Tyson said. Oh, <laughs> it says I fucking disown him. <laughs> disown yeah, him. Him. Didn't, didn't change his name and all. Like, you know I mean? Didn't he say that to change his name and all if he lost? If he lost, did yeah. he? Yeah. Well, well, there's there's lot... I would believe that. Like what he he said. No, I can't from his from his mother's. What did he say? <laughs> he said something mad. Won't be he, a fury. Oh, he has a he. The John mad. Fury's the best. Yeah, he's Big wild. John isn't he? Fury, yeah. He's wild. There was something about that's why the first one cancelled because uh, them two weren't allowed in they America. Into America, yeah. Overall, the fucking empty case shit and stuff like that. That, that is my Yeah. And here will they, the leading up to this this big fucking uh, the big fight and all and your your deal and all with the train all be extra fucking yeah, like heavy. What was the what you're in fight camp now at the minute? Eh? Yeah, just so what's a fight camp look like? Like for the for the big fight. Are like you saying? Like out of fifty two weeks a year, I train fifty weeks. Like so, you stay ready, so you don't have to get ready. Always. As they say, like that, and like I don't know if you drink, but like my mates going to the pub for to meet the lads and watch the match for a couple of points. Like that's me going to the gym and meeting me mates for a session. Like do you know yeah, what I mean? true, that's yeah. my thing. Like do you know what I mean? Yeah. My best mate owns the gym with training. Like really? so, uh, 
that's just me. Like that's I where you socialize. Exactly. That's your socialize. Exactly. That's, that's my spot. that's my little spot. Yeah. Like, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, I've been in that gym since the day it opened. So that's where. Is that I'm the call scene? No, uh, you and a tree helping fitness and nice. All oh, right, right, right. Um, Noel Barrett opened that up five years ago. Noel and Gary. Shout out the two Noel. boys. Shout out the Shout boys. Noel and Gary and all the unit tree fam. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. There, that's where my mates are, like, do you know what I mean? Yes, um, and my missus works there now. She, I met there her four go. years ago, and now she's, she's <laughs> on a job in there. So that's just where I am all the time, do you know what I mean? But I, as well as that, <coughs> I am very, very focused on where I want to get to as well, yeah. do you know what I mean? So I can't, like... You can't fuck about. It's probably unhealthy in a way that, like, I can't switch off. Like, the morning after a fight, I'm like, fuck, who's next, like? Do you know what I mean? Yeah, Who am I yeah, getting next? Ready you know yeah. Yeah. I want to go again, like, yeah. but you have to let your body recover, obviously, yeah. as well. The camps are hard. Even after the last fight, the fight wasn't hard. The fight was only 30 seconds, but the camp, the was, the camp was 12 weeks. Like, because yeah. you're putting your body, your mind. That's a lot, like, isn't it? What yeah. type of mind set it's, would you have to have for these type of camps? I don't think it's, uh, like like you said, phys- physically wise, like, I train all year round, so that yeah. doesn't really take much out of me. Obviously, if you get caught or you hurt your hand or something yeah. like that, that's different, but emotionally, like, you have to go into a different, like, my missus says four weeks out, she notices a switch going. I'm not there anymore. Like yeah, just zoned in. Night time, watching a movie on Netflix. Or yeah. I'm just not there anymore. I go into like, and then once I get the fight week, like you're I definitely feel done. My eyes go different. Like, I'm <laughs> Would just, you go like, red? You're ready to go. I'm just ready to go, but like not in the way of like. I'm very relaxed about the whole situation as well. Like we had a speaker going in my last change room, and I was dancing in the change room yeah. for five minutes before I had to go. Like it's. Did it's, you put a clip or something up like that? Yeah, or, or you think the, it's it that, yeah. a little little shadow boxing yeah. clip. Some yeah. people had to be like that, though, don't they? Like obviously, that's the way you are. Like you just if you didn't do that and you sat there fucking panicking yeah, and fucking yeah, like you like, can think about that, it too much. Yeah, I think I've learned over like I probably would have been like that when I first started out as yeah. a pro, we go to sports psychology now. I've learned a lot from that, and just getting older and getting a little bit wiser and yeah. getting more experience. Every fight I have, I'm, I'm more experienced than the last yeah, one. Course, you know yeah. what I mean? So I'm learning more and more. Even just even if the fight's only thirty seconds, it's going to the changing room, dealing with the press conference, yeah. doing a face to face with an opponent. Yeah, exactly. all that stuff's massive. What like, is that? Like, what, what is, is the that feeling like? like of doing a press conference and everyone's like, "We have Gary here." We we'll tell you all like this. Man. What story? Yeah. Oh, yeah, no. I, I kind of like to. Pre- I prefer to like once I get the fight week, I'm like. Especially because you're so fight ready, everybody's like, "Oh yeah, and then make sure you in my sports psychologist always says to me, make sure you enjoy fight week. So pick every day, and at the start of every morning, make sure you enjoy that day because it starts on the Monday, and, and you're so focused on the Saturday right. that you're fighting on the Saturday that you're like, right, my mind's all in the yeah, Saturday. Yeah, not doing that. And but like, not many people get the experience at press conference away, yeah, 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 like yeah. all this kind of stuff. And even me, I've had fifteen fights. Fingers crossed, get fifteen more. So you get to do it thirty times and then it's finished. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I won't ever do it again. Yeah, so like they sort of look at it. They sort of look at it like oh, I'll just want to get this out of the way just to get to Saturday for the exactly. Free. Everybody, everything's focused on yeah, Saturday. Yeah. But even me, I'm coming to the point now where I actually enjoy camps like yeah. and hard sessions and all them. Yeah, I'm yeah. like try and enjoy that part of yeah. it as well because there's a day where you want them back as well. Like, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Ten years, I'm done. Like ten years, less than ten years. What am I now? I'm twenty six now. Like I always say thirty four. I'm done. Were you ever 34? fighting someone where you where you face off and you actually did want to hit each other when you were facing off? Did it ever get heated like that? The the Fitzpatrick, Joe Fitzpatrick, the one I said to you as I went up to Belfast. Yeah. Fast, um, Obviously, because it was such a big fight, like yeah, it was. He was ten and oh, I was nine and oh. Oh, he's he, a he was two years older than me in the amateurs. He won a Commonwealth silver medal and he was a good amateur and all. And, um. Was I a bit of beef on that? No. Like he kind of, uh, there was no beef on my side. I was kind of, yeah. I was very relaxed about yeah. the whole situation. And then we came to face off at the weigh-in and uh, he had a few mates there. His big brother was there and he started oh, getting giving the the chest out and all. Oh, I'll knock you out, he said. And I was like, when are you going to knock me out? He says, I'll knock you out now. Go on ahead then. <laughs> Go and, for it, mate. Uh, he started, <laughs> started, started pushing me and all this, but like. Imagine what's it. Like, you can what's, do all that stuff. What do you do when they say that back to you? Really go on. It doesn't, yeah. Like, you just, you're, not, you're going to do it then. Like, you're not going to do it. Like, no. You're not because, going to because do it. Because sometimes, like, like, in bigger scale fights, like, if you touch each other, that's money deducted. Oh, so is it? Yeah, yeah, you get fines and stuff. Yeah, yeah you could, like, yeah, yeah I've yeah. seen, but, like, 
that would like Fury a couple of years back would have got got fines and Chisora. Oh, I remember, remember, like, remember when he used happened. to come in in the costumes and Chaos all. And, all this kind of <laughs> stuff. and Del Boy was uh, kissing lads and all, wasn't he? Oh Del, yeah, he Del, was. Chisora, yeah, Chisora, Chisora, yeah. People and what I'm getting fines for? He's a wind up cunt. I think David Hay hit someone as well. David Hay hit someone at yeah. a Oh, that was a mad one actually. They went through that was all Chisora, the actually, yeah. wasn't it? They was went them? through all the fucking the background stuff and all through tables and all. Yeah, they actually picked up a sound, table and fucked them. That sounds like the background of wrestling or something. Yeah, uh, sometimes it goes like that. I'm not saying I'll never get to a fight where that won't happen yeah. either. Like, do you know what I mean? Because never when, say never. when the stakes are higher and like let's say I travel to America and there's like the last couple of fights I've had, everybody the fighters have either not spoke English or been very respectful towards me. So yeah, if you're yeah, respectful yeah. towards me, you I'm going to shake your hand yeah. and be respectful Course. towards yeah. you. The first thing I do when I go into a fight week, we're staying in the same hotel as our opponents for the whole week, yeah? yeah. First time I see an opponent, I walk over, how are you? Nice to meet you. But you size him up, like, shake your hands. Like, squeeze his hand, see what he's doing. Hold his hand as long yeah. as he can go. But people get, like, more thrown off by someone being polite to them. Like or did they go, go in? Everybody expects yeah. you to go in and be looking. looking yeah. Like do you say, what's up with this fella being nice and all? How are you? Nice to meet you. And they're kind of like, oh, what the fuck's Yeah, I was thinking he was going to be a prick or something. Um, but like, I might go to America and fight one of these. Wait, who would you, would you see yourself fighting in America? America? Yeah. yeah, 100%. Like, who's in your, who Javon was in, Davis. Oh, you're Devin in Hayes, Ryan Garcia type of... What? So Ryan what about you start again? 135. But what is it? Lightweight. Lightweight. Lightweight, yeah. That's a lot big, that's a serious pool of fighters. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah so that's that what is I'm savage. aiming like. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I so what I say October is the end of the year, would you like to go to America to I fight? I want to go hopefully Crow Park happens in May and I'd like to headline the tree Get a big finish in Crow Park over. and then finish the year in America. Imagine that. Either finish the year in America or finish the year headline the tree arena. Seven imagine that. Imagine just how, imagine being able to just sit back and say manifest that, that stuff. Yeah, hundred percent. We'll manifest it as well. We for are you, the kings of manifestation. Yeah, yeah. 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 We'll manifest it for you now. Manifest it's real life magic, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is hundred percent. The closest yeah, imagine, thing to no, voodoo. Like, but <laughs> honestly, it? just imagine being able. To, imagine just being him and just being able to sit back and go. Yeah, Dun Crow Park, Dun Tree Arena. There we are. some 2023. Oh my God, man! Imagine how it happens for you. Hundred percent. Yeah, I know. Look. It's starting to take off, and I've always believed that it would happen for me. So yeah. now I'm just like, now the time is. No, but Jan- like genuine, like even when we were talking to, uh, remember we had Dean Berry on. Yeah. And I, yeah, I know his cunt. went fucking, or whatever. Yeah, he was but, in UFC, wasn't he? Yeah. Poor cunt. What happened? To him? But, he just never got any luck. <laughs> he always got a man, didn't he? And then he was gone. Yeah, but like, it's like visas and all. He couldn't get a visa. He had to fight in fucking I don't know Mexico what or something. Remember? He was fighting somewhere. Yeah, he had to somewhere fight somewhere wasn't. else. To get into America then, and then he got came back home. His fight was cancelled twice or something like that. A fella pulled out. And see these lads, you think like, oh yeah, UFC are after signing me. These love me. These, this, these, that. It's a conveyor belt. You yeah. lose a fight. The fella yeah, who's after beating is getting signed. Like, yeah. do you know what I mean? You better yeah, man, Jackson that. or something his name was. Jackson, he fought, yeah. And he always got out someone and yeah. he called it off. And he was and gone. Didn't, and then. here, I didn't even hit him. Didn't even, hit him. didn't even get him in the eye. A man was a pussy old man went down like that. Yeah. Because he knew the team was going to See, well, all these him. things, you need a bit of luck as well. You need yeah. luck on your face. He was slaughtering, but what I was saying was like, the even with... Even with God uh, rest you, the sniper. <laughs> yeah, God rest the sniper, yeah. He's even still, with, uh, you still alive, like, yeah. It's good. <laughs> man, what's up? Oh, Jesus Christ. Just talking about his UFC. Yeah, just talking about his UFC career, man. God rest you, it's gone. No, but we're saying like even with Gary, like it's good when you when you meet like sound people that are doing it. I hate when there's arseholes. Like who? It's just like you know, a few names. Cool. Like you. Oh, I won't say anyone, but like oh, yeah, no, it's good when but you, you get know arseholes, yeah. Yeah, one or two, yeah. No, but when you get when you get noise people and you say, Yeah, do you know what I hope happens? Yeah, look, but I'm just I mean? like going to use as well. Do you yeah, know that's what I'm saying. Like, in a state good. like this as well. Like, yeah, 100%. people get too big for the boots, don't they? And start thinking never too big for that, the boots. Hundred percent. But here yeah. and as well, I know you are saying like you're always ready. Yeah. But like, do you ever do you ever find it hard to get motivated some days? Yeah, a lot of days. Yeah, a lot of days. Yeah. What gets you going? Oh, like, find a lot of days I go hard. in and I'm like, I don't feel like sparring. I'm after fucking. Doing a running session yesterday, like ten k mad time on a treadmill, and doing a boxing session. Yeah. And I have to spar ten rounds today. I'm getting up and going. I don't want to do it. Yeah, fuck go. this. That that thought. <laughs> I know. I just that thought the used to come into my mind. I don't want to do it. Now it's just like I'll just. I'm just so used to it. I just go and get it. Like, it's just like routine. I mean, now, like, yeah. like if this had of 
interfered with my training and I couldn't have came. Like, I have to train twice a day, like, and I, I won't sleep tonight if I don't train twice a day. Like, and did you train twice a day? Yeah, you made sure. You <laughs> made sure I trained at 11, I trained at 4, and then I came up here. But even even off days, like, if I'm not if I'm not in camp, if I don't train, like, yeah. I can't sleep if I don't train. And do you find it hard to balance everything with, like, like obviously... Oh, yeah, that's a good question. Yeah, obviously you're saying... Uh, Obviously, you have partner or whatever, yeah, and like family and all that. You find it hard. Like I don't really. I'll tell you, it is hard. Like, I don't really. It's all. Fo- it's all in and this. Yeah. Is it? Yeah, it's all in but, and this. But like, but it's well. Like, you have to think of it. The <laughs> woman is gonna understand. Like she's now. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, he's like, like, he's like he just but, gonna be books coming. It's a. <laughs> there's, there's buzz <laughs> coming. Yeah, he's not sound. She's just sitting there like, oh, yeah. But it has to be realistic. Like there is money coming. He's growing loads of money. He's growing and. And it's gonna be coming, but it's a hard position to be in as well. Like, yeah, you know, I, mean, I had seven months there where, like, I from March I fought Vasquez to October when I fought Belmedi, so seven months where I didn't fight. And like, that was true the summer where everybody's going to a beat, they're going on holidays. You see couples all, all over your yeah, Instagram, it's hard, and, yeah, yeah. and, and I was just training, and I didn't think about it because I was oh, like, so there was going more to than in the now, gas. and like, yeah. I don't know when I'm fighting, but I'm going to be yeah. fighting soon. And she was just like, oh, like she doesn't didn't say it obviously, but I'm like, oh, I know that. So you're due a holiday, are you? Due a holiday for sure, yeah. Due Jeez, a holiday. You're, you're she's due a holiday, <laughs> definitely. Nah, uh, but like, it's a big, uh, big commitment for her as well. Like, do you know what I mean? And yeah, then like I said, she's four weeks out. Like, you should forget about having you're, a boyfriend. Do you know you're a mean? different animal. Yeah, I'm I say what? Yeah. Like, see, is sleep a big part of your routine as well? Yeah. I hear massively, a lot of people talking about sleep. Massively. I, I haven't read the book yet. Your man, Matthew Walker, was on Joe Rogan, but I yeah. listened to a bit of the podcast. But, like, I've never, had, I've never had a problem with sleep. But, uh, oh, you do. Sleep is heal. Is that what they say? Sleep is what? Sleep is heal. Heal? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you need. Never heard that. One. Sleep is healed, sleep. so you heal quicker when you're asleep. Like the heal, like out of bread, like. That's what <laughs> I thought. No, no, like, like, like you heal quicker, we get up. like muscles, everything. Like, I know, when you're asleep, no, like, that's you know I mean? that's true. Like, yeah, no, sleep is it like. I, he, he was now saying sleep is healing and he was like <laughs> I'm not saying that to you about the bread again <laughs> yeah, that sleep is healed you nearly got him to say <laughs> nah but I am like in camp I'm asleep at, I'm in me in bed at 9 o'clock every night but my, I, I would be like you like I'd be a little bit later but my missus since I met her she's like 8 o'clock she's falling asleep like so she's always going to bed so then it just got me into the routine yeah. 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 so you know see I mean? so, uh, so see in America they're always fighting late. See, I'm just I don't know why I'm using this cunt all the time. But Jake Paul, yeah, mm. he I watched an interview he, he done. Him, that's why. Right, he s- stays awake and goes asleep at fucking what? It's four four or five o'clock in the morning. Mm. He goes asleep back to stay awake and be ready for his body clock for the late night fights. Well, my camps like if my boxing sessions <laughs> are every morning. I do meet my strength or my conditioning is in the evening, so. I box at 11 o'clock every morning and I could be doing 10 rounds of sparring at 11 in the morning. But I don't fight at 11 in the morning. I fight at 8 or 9 in the evening. Yeah, true. So we, like two weeks out, I'll change my... Sparring over. My uh, sparring and my pads and stuff and I'll start coming into the gym at 7 or 8. To get the body used to the only sparring at that time, yeah. That's yeah. mad, isn't it? Well, I was it's in it's Dubai it's last just... year. Like, if you're fighting anywhere else, they say an hour, a day for every hour or something to adjust Fire. to the time zone. Oh, yeah. But I was in Dubai for a week and I was still going to bed at 3 o'clock over there, which would have been like 11 over here, which would have been normalish for me over here. Like, couldn't get used to it at all. Like, I've I never been to the boys. I'd love to go to the boys. You had to do that with uh, with the World Cup, didn't they? They all had to fucking go earlier. Do it, yeah, do that fucking body clock and shit. Say acclimatise to the Yeah, acclimatise, that's the word. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The body oh, clock. Yeah, it's how it does fuck you. It is mad. It's mad how the body works. Body is fucked. Some people are fucked as well today, according to you. <laughs> 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 so it is mad how the fucking <laughs> body works. <laughs> but I wanted to talk about your the gold. You won a gold, didn't you? You won what a, is a European Sorry. Youth Championship. That was amateur medal. days, yeah. That was back in 2013. 2013? Yeah, so I was what? I'd be wearing that gold medal all the time. It's in, me, it's in my mask. <laughs> <gaff, actually. laughs> it's in my mask <laughs> on the kitchen window. I see it every time I'm in the gaff. Right job. But uh, yeah, that was 2013. And was that like a tournament type thing? Yeah, so like you went to your Leinster Championships. Yep. You'd have Leinster Championships first, your regionals. You have to win them to get into the All Irelands. Were you All Ireland champion? Yeah, yeah sixth national title. You have, to, you have to win the nationals then to get on to squad training, which is the Irish team. Yeah, and then 
you get sent to like let's say European or World Championships. See when you were fighting, do you, would you remember like has anyone made it from when you were doing it that time? Like even like when you fought against English or French well, even? I went to Russia. That was my first trip around two thousand and two thousand and eleven. We went to Russia. Um a nice bar to Cor Stevenson in a hallway in Russia. In a hallway. He, I boxed at <laughs> I boxed at fifty kilos and he boxed at forty eight kilos. <laughs> Fuck, that's the, light, lads. Yeah, the, but we were probably what I was fourteen at that time, maybe. Um, and the lads were out, there was the Americans and the Irish were at each other going, "Oh, he'd win, he'd win," because I fought a guy who the American was fifty kilos. Right. I fought the Americans fifty kilos, but he was the weight below me, so I didn't fight him. Obviously, um, the lads were always, "Oh, he'd win, no, he'd win," and they were right, having a bit of back, back and forth. And, forth yeah. like, and two of us ended up sparring then in the. <laughs> it was like, oh, we came and then the just fucking inspired him. On now so, see who will. Yeah, well, I've always said to him then, ever since, we're going to make some money. MGM Gram one day will make some money in Vegas, and uh, he's doing his thing. So Is he doing like, well? Yeah. He's, he won two belts unified at Super Featherweight, and he stepped up to Lightweight now, so he's stepping up. Oh, he hasn't he, had a fight at Lightweight. Here, here it is. He's doing his Imagine thing. So, what, what, a, what a mad circle. It all a mad story of what happened. All, yeah. yeah, all swings and rounds about. Yeah, it does, as yeah. they say, doesn't it? Traffic lights as well. Yeah, yeah. traffic lights, <laughs> everything. <laughs> the heels of red and orange getting thrown in. Fucking hell! We're, go- we're gonna make loads of fights on this episode. Here, who else you call? <laughs> <laughs> who else can you get these fight actually? <laughs> yeah, me fighting everybody. He was gonna have a fight as well. So no, I, I, I want to fight. Have another one. I want to fight commentate. this year. Yeah, yeah. I actually yeah. yeah. I want to get back to training with the boys. Who do you eh? want to fight? A few people. Don't talk about call a few way. people out there. Go on, call someone out there. Uh, he he wants. To, he's dying to fight Conor Ryan. Oh, I was just going to say Conor Ryan. I saw his stuff yesterday. They saw his stuff yesterday. Oh, we have a picture actually, don't we? Yeah. We saw yeah, his stuff yesterday. Yeah, you fancy that one, yeah? Uh, Conor, I would like the lad. But it'd be a, <laughs> fuck, it'd be, it'd be a <laughs> first round. I was going to wait. Till, we were supposed to have him at four o'clock. I was going to do it on the episode, but do it on this Conor brother. It's going down. That's, that's me. Yeah, that's me. You have an inch or two on him. Is that alone yet? Uh, bigger What's the weight like? That. What's his weight Look like? Look at that, son. Yeah. Busting the top. Yeah, you would have a bit of wood. <laughs> <laughs> I'd, I'd probably be heavier than him. Now, now I'm like, I oh, yeah, maybe just fight someone else. <laughs> oh, yeah? I'll probably be all around champion by the end of the year. <laughs> <laughs> They're actually next week. Are they the yeah, championships yeah. yet? Paulie, Pajo, put me into that there. What? What's... We'll get down to 83. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, well, my here, weight is my problem, man. I well, can't here, get do you down. Do else? Yeah, what other hobbies do you have? Yoga. What? Yeah, I started yoga. Well, yeah, that's hard, boys. Wrong yoga gig. as well, I do, yeah. Is what, in a sauna? Yeah, it's like a, an infrared sauna, heated room, like... Um, Oh my god, some sweats off it, like... Some serious... Like, I could lose... That's very like, good for you, that infrared uh, heat room. Yeah, yeah. I only went... I started yoga... Oh, like, I... I, sp- I got sponsored by a place, Infinity um, Recovery Center in Minute. It's yeah. where we go to the recovery center, and they, they also do uh, hot yoga. Jumped in the class one day, I was like, oh, I could never touch my toes, yeah? I was like, well, I'll jump in the class. I don't here. think I can either. Oh, you definitely can't. My hamstrings oh, I blame, I blame, I blame me height I did for years. Ah, there you go now. the hammer, snare has gone. <laughs> yeah, see? Don't do that crumbling match on Sunday. That's cancelled. What is it, why? Yeah, the prussios, crumbling, these are all prussios down there. <laughs> For the team, not everyone down there. Don't be shocked. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> and while you were in, you jumped into a yeah, class. Yeah, I jumped into oh. a class down there, uh, oh, just oh, purely for flexibility to see if we could. I was like, can't touch my toes, right? My goal this year is I'll be able to touch my toes. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that was two years ago. And then I just like. Can you touch your toes now, yeah? Let's see. We have to bend the knees a little bit. Team. Oh, yeah, he's there, yeah. yeah. His legs are long. Yeah. Shout out to Infinity. Yeah, shout out to Infinity. You can invite me a monks over as well. Infinity. Like. <laughs> Here, now you know where I actually want to go. Oh, I was only saying to him when I picked him up. I want to do that uh, floating yoke. Oh, we just went there today. Yeah, you're there today. Sessions, yeah. 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 Oh, I oh, want lads. to try it. What is it? The little pod yoke. Right, bring yeah. me, bring me yeah. through it. Tell me what it's all like. Oh, you right. zone out, do you? Like, surely you go under at some stage. You sleep. couldn't float the whole time. No, you float, yeah. You so sleep. it's it's uh even when you let your breath out. But let him say it. What do you mean, like? You go So you're like, surely you go under. Under what? Yeah, you're under water, like. Yeah. It's only a little bit of water. Yeah, but you're oh, floating on the top of the water. Like it's like a bat like. 
He yeah, can't flow. He sings. Well, he can't flow. <laughs> <laughs> no, Jaylen. Did you do swimming he... lessons? <laughs> well, then, <there. laughs> He's sitting there. I don't know how to do flow. <laughs> no, <laughs> you're the same. Yeah, some money for you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Did he put salt in it to make you flow? 500 kilos of Epsom salt there is so in, in every bag. Is what I'm saying. Oh, you don't think so. Float. That's it's flotation therapy. Right. So right. Sponsor is an episode. There. Yeah. Basically. Right. Happy day. Never been the Red Sea. I know if I'm not sinking. Yeah. No. There's 500 kilos of Epsom salt. Oh in the I'm going to have a bat in Epsom salt tonight. And then the heat, <laughs> the heat, the water to body temperature. So the trick is that you're not supposed to feel your body then when you get into oh. it. Like, and then you're floating and you're just left with what's up there. What, Do you know what I mean? But oh, I've had mates. About I've this. sent mates yeah. in, and they've ran out after fifteen minutes. Going, I don't know how you do that, like. Yeah, because because you can't because the challenge is to be able to sit with yourself. For, how long can you stay in for? Like I'm, the the sessions are sixty minutes, and I'm gonna start doing double sessions. So I'm gonna stay in there for two hours instead. And how long? Lord, the, boys, that's boy, I do a lot of meditation. So well. I'm used to that now. I, like that's two, a paddy, two, two three years ago, I couldn't do that. But like now, I'm on. Now I'm, you're I'm on a certain level now. with like with meditation and with like I'm I'm just used to it where I'm able to. Oh, he tried the meditation. Not a, I'm not even gonna. I'll tell you a little story, right? So I was in my sitting room, yeah, trying that meditation, and no one was out. So this, <laughs> so I didn't want anyone being in the gas when I was doing it. So fucking. I put, I put, think you were some mad thing or something. Yeah, like, I, had it. I was in my sitting room. <laughs> what are you doing? And, uh, I, I just set, put a pillow on the floor in the sitting room. Right for, I don't know why I set, I had my legs, tried to cross my legs and not sitting on my pillow. Right? And so I'm just sitting there. You went all in, yeah? Oh, he's just sitting there. See, I was sitting there. <laughs> <myself, laughs> and I was, here, I, was sitting, I was sitting there, had the yoke on the YouTube there, had, had meditation sounds on. Right? Did you do this? No, I didn't even do that. What I should have. Mm. And I was trying to say, I was like, so <laughs> had, had my eyes no, closed, closed, and I was like, so when is this gonna kick in? Sitting there, if you're kick in. Oh, honest to God, God, like God, I, yeah. I was thinking to myself, so am I meditating here? Like, the <laughs> Arden. <laughs> so yeah, I was, yeah, I was like, thoughts coming into your head. Am yeah, I meditating? So I was sitting there for twenty five minutes, thinking to myself. Yeah, I'm just waiting for this to kick in or something to happen. No, never happened. I'm <laughs> just sitting there, boy. Well, yeah. So what? That's meditation. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so there you go, boy. So, <laughs> nothing kicked in, so what? Yeah. Oh, I was yeah. just doing nothing. Doing doing 25 nothing. That's minutes. That's exactly what it is. My knees were in bits, boy, did I? <laughs> yeah, I just lying in the bed, man. <laughs> Yeah, I never thought of that. <laughs> no, but, <laughs> but, <laughs> but boys, it's not meditation if you're on your bed and sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, true. Oh, it's hard because we fall hard asleep, boys. It is hard to stay awake sometimes, especially yeah. if you have the heat ready or whacked up to the max, and you have scalded <laughs> and you have your little blanket there with you. That They're is, gone. That is hilarious. You have to be sitting up straight and just meditate. Yeah. Speaking that from is, experience, yeah. That for that one time, 24 minutes. <laughs> I'm going to try that when I go home. 100%. Is there, um, have to try when I go home. Is there any uh, arena or place you've, that you've boxed in that's been your favourite so far? Uh, probably the SSE in Belfast. Because oh, it was like early days. Yeah. And I was fighting in, in big arenas. But like. Was that against your man, Paddy? Is that what you said his name was? Joe Fitzpatrick. Oh, sorry, Actually, Joe. that was in the Ulster Hall. And like, if you were to think back of moments from my career, like so far, that's probably my favourite moment. That that place only holds, they, like it's kind of famous for its atmosphere. Um, it only holds maybe about a thousand people, but it was like packed to the rafters that night. Yeah, right job, Evan Eighty percent was like his crowd as well, John. Oh, right? I say you look. I love that even more because you're oh, all against you. It's unreal. And you're looking at me maybe then, and then they all start jumping in the ring after throwing fucking throwing beer uh, bottles into the ring and all that, man. Do you watch home stuff? Yeah, yeah, they were the tramps. Oh. Yeah, yeah, we get a rematch against him. He'll be down. <laughs> he has not boxing. He has not boxing. Has since you oh, slept him. Yeah, it was two thousand. Is he still? I oh, heard he's still asleep. Twenty twenty. He could be like he could possibly be. <laughs> oh, I heard. Oh, I heard he's God gone for a long him, yeah. nap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I heard he got sleep apnea and he's gone now forever. Oh no! Did you ever hear that sleep paralysis? 
Yeah, paralysis. Oh, yeah. oh man, we heard a few. Ma- Wait, no, never got. Fuck no. that shit, boys. Oh, we actually told some dude. <laughs> <laughs> me and Monks went on a podcast there <laughs> for uh, some lad there two weeks ago and uh, it wasn't visual or anything, thank god or it's just audio but I told him right that we oh, were sleep paralysis <laughs> <laughs> and I told him that some fella kept grabbing me leg when I was asleep and on. I, sh- I told just him make it up. just made it up yeah because like, I said to him here, come on, it's me, a Christmas episode. We were talking about fucking Halloween. Halloween stuff <laughs> I told him, come on, me. I said, can we make a mad story up here to see if it goes around into that? Around. And did he have a clue? No, he thought he was like, are you, yeah. are you actually missing? Are you? Oh, no, I was like, I'm deadly, deadly serious. I said, I was p- pulled out my bed and all. I told him I was pulled into the shadow <laughs> realm and all. <laughs> No way, yeah. but that was fake, yeah. Whoever, yeah, that you made sick, it all up, yeah. made it all up. So, here, look, hold on, fucking hell, I'm actually been telling everyone <laughs> yes. about that. It never fucking happened madness. to me, but if it did happen to someone out there, I'll oh, fucking uh, oh, wish us good luck and uh, get a dream catcher because that's what I got so when here, I was told. Yeah, we have that's what fixes it, actually. Oh, you had a dream. Oh, I'm not going into that one. <laughs> dream catchers, oh, you had three dream catchers, yeah, my whole entire lifetime, and three of them went missing on me now. That's yeah, spooked. off the back of your door. Off like, the back of me fucking gone. headboard. You'd hear, you'd hear someone taking them the jingles and all out. No, there's no jingles on the <laughs> feathers, <laughs> man. There's little uh, bells and all hanging out the bottom of the Don't know what you're getting because they're not dream catchers, man. Yeah. Dream catchers are like a fucking circled yeah, web, innit? Yeah. Did you ever see it? The web. Oh, no, yeah. And they're, little, they're like Indian feathers. Oh, yeah, sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mine had bells on it. Yeah, and they got robbed on you, yeah? Don't know about robbed or s- someone took them. It could, have been, it could have the been some realm. sort of entity or something. Oh. Do you believe yeah, in that, auntie, yeah? Not your yeah, it was just not me, auntie. <laughs> <laughs> auntie. <laughs> 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 Bring your auntie out to this, yeah? She has them on. We aren't going on a mad anyway. Yeah, we did, we did. But here, you bring her back around town. Let's bring her back around town. So you're saying the SSC? SSC. Or the, no, the. the no, hall. yeah, SSC, but. No, Ulster Hall was my favourite moment, definitely. What about that in the hallway, no? Against your man sparring, that was a good spot. <laughs> yeah, that was good. I still remember that as well. Yeah, true, yeah. Um, oh, here I'll show you is a picture of that place after this. That look, we went to. That was my first trip away with the Irish team. Uh, we went to it was called Crasador or something. So we flew Ireland to Latvia, Latvia to Moscow, Moscow to Crasador. These were all like seven hour flights. Yeah, bad names Riga, over there, don't yeah, you? Yeah, Riga was like four hours, then seven hours to Moscow. Then seven hours to this Krasnodar place and a five hour oh, bus right. journey, and there was nothing in this place in Russia. We were only 14 at the time. Shane said, um, Where am I? 12 or 13 of us on the team stayed in all Getting up to place, all sorts, I'd say, acting the hydraulics. But there was, like, there was nothing to do. There was nothing. Like, of another story, like, we did used to, we did use to act the bollocks, like, but. Only natural. Like, let's say you're going, like, my mate was, uh, my mate was renting an apartment there for a while, and there were security <laughs> cameras in it. And your man came to him, the landlord came to him and told him he had to take him down there facing into a play school next door. He had no idea. What? Yeah, like, obviously <laughs> he had no idea because no he wouldn't way. do that intentionally. Yeah, exactly. Do you know what I mean? mean? But oh, you it. know what I do in hotels? I, I said it to him a few times. I always check for, I even follow a few pages on TikTok and uh, Instagram for hidden cameras in uh, hotel rooms. Yeah. Uh, all hidden, like, in double-sided mirrors and all. It freaks me out. <laughs> I always check all the uh, clocks the smoke alarms all over the place. Every hotel you go to? Every hotel, home or away. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but what if you're you cl- sleeping in the hotel? What if you're hotel? clapping cheeks and someone's recording you? And what? Then you're yeah. watching Scorty Car Barn. Then you're in the fucking vortex. And someone's making money on. off me and I'm not getting any money. Yeah, well, once you're getting a few quid for it, I suppose it's that's yeah, exactly. That that's right. that's we that's have where, to let you know first. That's so. where it all comes around, round swings and roundabouts. Will we go on OF and make a few pound? Or will we? Yes or no? But what I want to say, Jake Paul, offer him two point five million plays. I'll fight you, Jake Paul. No problem. Yeah. Well, I'd say you wouldn't, all, wouldn't you? No bother. Hundred percent. He's a good guy. Wait, I mean, no, so if you you have an opponent for your next fight, do you, no, is Stone. No, are yeah, you no. still are searching you someone up? Yeah, few like few. Um, but as you as you as I'm moving up the rankings now, like it's getting harder and harder to match me because I don't hold the belt at the minute, and lads are just looking gone. Like too good. Like go on to Google and just search my name, 
and watch the first three videos. Like, yeah, yeah. And they just so there needs to be someone that. E- that thinks they're even better than you, or yeah, that wants a shot. But then you're talking like a a, a world title eliminator, like do you know what yeah. I mean? Somebody who's who's up so around that level as well. But it. like if you're looking for a building fight or to build experience or yeah. anything like that, like I'm looking someone I'm looking for, for a cash grab. I fought. I haven't fought ten rounds fully yet. Like, and my next, my, if I fight in Croke Park, co headline, it's going to be a twelve round fight. And I've had three ten rounders, and they've all the 12, stopped early. You, like, you won't go to the distance. That's You're sleep, see, sleep, that's, man. That's the. Slap. That's the. What? I never thing, actually. But, never actually asked what your name. Like, what's the name? Who, who are you missing? Who's the diva man? What Ring name. Yeah. The diva, but you were the only there recently, weren't yeah. you? Yeah, the diva. The diva, yeah. I never knew that. I never actually checked that. Who did? Did he? Yeah. Um, but you had Looney on your shorts. I had Looney. My granda died in May last year, so oh, he was at army that fight. Part? So that was uh, yeah, it sounds voice. That was a uh, tribute to him. The last one, but I've been the diva from the diva. Where did that come about? That was just a joke as well because uh, one of the lads at one of the weigh-ins. Uh, so there's a guy in a fight week that like if you need that and you're you're fighting you need that and get, ring me all sort yeah. of like a PA like a PA basically yeah Lee Eaton um, Lee Eaton that's his name yeah. show out Lee Eaton Lee's my boy yeah sometimes um, he's eating sometimes he's not he's yeah. always eating he's actually in fat <laughs> he's, he's, always he's eating. in fat combat at the minute he's a loser <laughs> away, yeah. I didn't mean but, to slag uh, it brother <laughs> yeah he called me a diva one day just said oh you're you're such a diva or something and then I made a joke saying there was no walk-in wardrobe at, in my hotel room or something for the fight. And then I said, ah, my next fight, I'm coming with pink shorts with the Dave on them. And I did. And then it just stuck. But, like, it probably does actually suit me. Like, it probably well, does. Yeah, I, for a while, like, I'd be like, ah, I'm not a diva. And I always say, like, I'm not a diva because I work fucking hard in the gym. I'd say it's hard to find a name, a nickname. So that won't count to organically, maybe. Yeah, maybe. So... But it, I feel like it, uh, like I'll do something some days, and like one of my mates or my missus or one of my family will go, you, you are a diva. Like, yeah, <laughs> a but like if you come to the gym to train with me, and or you're you, anybody who's on the team, and you're not busting your balls, like, yeah, I'm like, relentless. Get the fuck out here. Like yeah, but that's not being a diva. That, I, I think that's just high standards. Like, yeah, true. Yeah, you know. Would you have a nickname, Max? My nickname. Uh, uh, what would mine be? You actually had a funny one, I think, not long ago. I don't know. I, I just, I probably call myself. Uh, <laughs> uh, I don't know. There's so many ones to call me. I'm just that good. I'd call myself uh, anesthetic. David anesthetic simmer. Because I put you to sleep. Yeah. I call I call me myself uh, the dentist. Rearrange their teeth. Yeah, taking out teeth. That's actually not yeah, bad. that's a good one too. Anesthetic is a bit like a bit of a tongue twister, isn't it? Like not anesthetic. Trying to say that, like yeah, imagine like, ringing out got it wrong or something. It's the yeah. anesthetic fella. <laughs> here's, here's, here's Anastasia. Who now? Comes out yeah, but, yeah, like, <laughs> yeah. I'll have to rethink that myself. <laughs> <laughs> that's a big gas. Well, yeah. Who's right? I actually had this in my head earlier. Quick one. Who's your dream for you? Oh. As of now, maybe. Uh, or of all, all time. Even if you, if you, when, even when you make, if when you make it, not if when you make it. It's uh, I think it's that Stephen someone because so. yeah because the, because <clears throat> history it, yeah like since I'm what well, I was thirteen at that time yeah, and then we ended story. up like bumping into each other a couple of more tournaments and then he went to the Olympics won a silver in the Olympics and he bring just, up that fella there when he says his name yeah Shakur Stevenson yeah. Like Tupac Shakur, Shakur sure. Stevenson. That's nice. Um, but he's a superstar in America now, like. Oh, is he? Yeah. You would flatline him. That's what I heard. Well, That's you appreciate heard. boxing as well, yeah. And out of all the lads that we met, like Javante Davis, Devin, Hay, I think he's the best. Yeah, so actually. Yeah. So that's why I want to fight him as well. Tank is a beast, to, man. Tank is a beast, yeah. Tank's. Sounds like a beast. Tank's decent, like. Yeah, he'll be small, though. He's, 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 he's small. much more. He's small. He's what is he, 5'8 or something? Is it not even five six? I think. <laughs> you, yeah. Imagine you oh, looking oh, over. Yes. But it's hard. It's hard. They say it's harder for a taller fella to smite to fight a smaller fella. A taller. I've piece, had man. hand injuries because you're hitting the top of people's head like all the time. Yeah. People you're coming that way. So honestly, well, I don't. Amongst that, I don't think Monksy ever had a bare knuckle. Did you know? 
think once or did you? I had one fight. Did you ever fight either? Ever. You had your fight, obviously. Yeah, you never one fought fight in my life ever. Oh, I was a batter growing up, man. I flipped that was the switch it. when I was 16. You what? I flipped the switch down when I was 16 and started being good. Did you, yeah? Yeah, turned to new leaf. I had one fight on the white school, that was it. Yeah? Yeah, a fella from a completely different school followed me on the bus. Do oh, you remember it, yeah? Oh, was he? Yeah. Why? And here's how it happened, yeah, wait, here it is. Right? <laughs> <laughs> he, was a heavy, he was a heavy old dude, yeah. Oh, you didn't fight a heavier than that, did yeah, you? Yeah, and we had me, I had now my football bag on. We had a, a cup final with school that day. I know you shit myself. Uh-huh. I think I'm going to have to fight this fella on the way to school, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he come up behind me and he says, Well, you heard you said about me on the bus. I said, I don't even know you. He says, You do know me. And he pushed me right and I fell over my gym bag. got caught behind my legs. And he come over then, yeah. But in fairness, I actually ended up killing him. And I had him on the ground, and I had him in a head. No, but you need to you need to give us more no, context because so you said you were first time. It was the first time, time I ever. How did you get back up? What did you do? <laughs> I had to scroll my way back up. He was on top, you know, and it was like this. Now I'm trying to get him. <laughs> yeah, see, you weren't gonna say that until <laughs> you pulled it out. <laughs> and then I got out, and it, boys, it was the first time I ever flipped on you in my life. Yeah, I just done a big fucking. What's called them? Bicep curl, yeah. What did you over What's you give him a German suplex? No, I just lifted him like that from the inner toys. It was sort of sexual in a way. And I just grabbed him like that one. Up onto my shoulder, backwards, see you later. Then threw I threw him over your back. Right, yeah, then I just I just punched him down the back Do of the head. What did you I'm like that buddy here and I think, you stupid bitch. <laughs> did you ever try and punch his beard right. off? I'll punch his beard off. Right, had him on the ground. And then, yeah, this is the funniest part of it. Got me in the headlock and I had him there and he was trying to get out. I was like, will you just stop having a match in a while? I don't want to be fighting. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and then he was like, <laughs> and then he was like, <laughs> he was like let, me, let me go, let me go. And I was like, oh, let's go. You hit, don't hit me again. I have a match. And he said, right, go on. I won't hit you. And he got up there and I just walked off. Yeah, that was it. He said, yeah. Yeah, that video was comical. I'm not going to fight you now. I'll fight you tomorrow. <laughs> That's basically <laughs> what I was like. Yeah. I don't want to like, punch like, your head, head off, man. I'll go final in a few hours. I can't be fighting. <laughs> did you win the match? No, we actually didn't be lost. The last couple. Yeah, the last couple points. Yeah, two of them now so, in my lifetime. in the fight camp then, do you, specifically, do you not have sex before the fight? Or do you have sex? What is all this big thing about having sex and not having sex? I'd say, like, probably four weeks I don't have sex for. But, like I said, it's just that switch. It's not because I say to myself, you don't want I to. can't have sex. I just... I can't be arsed like I'm thinking about yeah. something else I'm in more mode like do you know what I mean so mm. I'm just like I don't think about my missus like that at that time like I don't think about yeah, that's I not where my mind is at like yeah. do you know what I mean so um, that's mad but yeah but what if like if, but you can't help you wake up the morning mud and it's on it's well just, like what's up with that what is that about just no no yeah, I, yeah, I only talked you know, about that on my board last week you know and what she is? was like will you remind me in the morning and let me see it's morning what mo- it's because she didn't believe we'll go me. Oasis the song. What's the story? Morning glory. Yeah. What is it about though? <laughs> Why does it happen? Because you wake up doing for the piss boys and Yeah, I do every morning. Uh, yeah. Is it not something got to do with a rush of blood or something? And yeah, it's the blood, so the it's the hottest part of your body. And uh disclaimer here. Because I'm not a scientist. <laughs> <laughs> but some, someone did die earlier. <laughs> someone yeah. did. Oh, he's made it to the halfway point. This is the halfway point here now where we say thank you to our sponsor. Help us out here big time. Yep. Camerakit.ie. Down in Terminal Business Park. Go down, get your high-end quality cameras, audio and lighting. If you can't find them, go into the link in our bio. Make sure you do it. Check it out. And let's get back to the episode. It's and he has confirmed it. Now the blood rushes to your ball sack, your testicular area, <laughs> <laughs> and just your yeah, rock solid. And that's good time to I do sex. wake up every morning bowling for a piss. Yeah, yeah. every single yeah. And it's yeah. always a Superman piss or a piss where you're kind of just like away from the jacks. Yeah, like that, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just I usually just God. put it under the sea. Sometimes you have to close the seat down on it. You have to go backwards and kind of. You have to go like that. You have to go backwards. And you're near your tippy toes. I just put it in and close the lid down. So the scratch doesn't go anywhere. Just sitting like that with the jacks, like this with the lid closed. Spraying in. I had a few blatant incidents of piss, man. Fuck all that. over the place, yeah. Right, Fuck even. pissing, boys. It's him, overrated. I told him a few pissing. Pissing is overrated. Do you want to hold it in? See, when you're doing them water loads, what I was telling you earlier <laughs> on, and try and say pissing's overrated. Fuck me, that's. 
Oh, boy, no, you can't beat a good piss oh, when it's you. coming down hell for letter I'm about 100 you. miles an hour. <laughs> <laughs> like a hose put oh, on or something, yeah. No, it's, you know what's even better? When you're, you know, when you're gargled and you end up turning into one of them outfits in the pub going like... And you're ah, swaying back and forth. And you end up doing that like... Ah, oh, yeah. Did you ever hear them in the, in the toilets? And they have their hand <laughs> on the wall like that. I think you're on your own, Captain Bullet. <laughs> Never done that before. So not, not, oh, can you imagine holding on to the wall and all? Yeah, holding on to the wall. Now, boys, I no, boy, say, ah, sorry. Can you remember the last time you were drunk? Even? Yeah. Or even allowed to say something like that? No. Yeah. <laughs> my my niece's christening in, what month was that? That was around April time. April? Uh, April last year. I drank you, twice last year. I gave it, 2023, I gave it up. I have to give it up. You're giving up this year? Yeah, because... Should we give it up nearly basically last year? Basically last year, and probably the year before, I may have drank twice that year. So Lord. Can't be honest. And look here, when I was... Out, I used to be out six, 17, probably didn't drink until I was just about 18, like, and then started drinking 17, 18, 19. Um, had a missus and all when I was, like, back, like, 17, 18, 19, then broke up with her, went on a bit of a mad one, and didn't suit me, like, I don't know, just starting fights. And I used to get, like, I probably an excuse that I'm using, but, like, just because I boxed, people used to go, oh, yeah, we'll have a go at him. Like, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, you think you're a boxer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that is a thing, though. Because there was a, I've seen a few instances like that, oh, that fella can box, and then you have the, the fella from the estate that thinks he's a good fighter and want to have a knockoff. Yeah, yeah. My friend's a backstreet brawler. That's what they used to say, oh, yeah. Boxer, oh, you're, oh, you're a boxer, I'm a backstreet brawler. Oh, you're fighting the streets. No, seriously. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's some who, bouncers who, and all that. You're going to bounce you, the boxer. Yeah, 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 it's different than street fighting, you know that? Fair enough, Pat. Can I come into the night? <laughs> 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 What's that up with people, That is mad though, man. isn't it? Yeah, people just, just because, like, just because do that's you think what you do. Think, like. Would you say you're getting more notice now? Because ah, it's it, after blowing up since, yeah. yeah, like the last six months, like, yeah. Yeah, I can't um, wait to get a picture with you now. Yeah, no, the last, the last <laughs> I went from probably, like, my Instagram was probably on our own tank here. I know that's not, it is good. It is, that's uh, it. Uh, that's uh, really good. But uh, a gauge of it, yeah. So it was probably doubled in the last six months. Like. That's, that's mad. Um, that's, and it'll just and keep it, going. And it'll just keep it's going. Just gonna, like, it's just going to keep snowballing. Yeah. So the next, this year is like, um, we were trying to, because I've been expecting this a long time. Like, it's not really a surprise to me. Like, it's, been coming. Yeah. it's been coming. But I've, I've, I've even, I'm with my missus four years now, and I'm saying to her, like, enjoy this last year. Like, as in May, 2022, yeah. enjoy this last year where we can actually, like, go to go about holiday your business. to Tenerife or to Spain and be left alone for a week. Because this yeah. year, like, <coughs> after Coke Park, you like, Spain, be... Tenerife, fucking. You yeah. won't be going yeah, to them places. Yeah, like you'll, you'll be Tenerife, you'll be going to Dubai and all. Yeah, I was in Dubai. I, don't, I wouldn't be a massive fan of it. Like. Oh, it's just too hot and too expensive. Yeah, and there's no real atmosphere there. Like it's Isn't a bit that? tense. Everybody's kind of yeah. It does yeah, sound like, tense. Just yeah. A bit like, Would you like, box there though? Yeah, I'd box there definitely. You box best. there? No, was that not what you said no. earlier? Oh, yeah, we're just there. Just oh, right, supposedly, yeah. Jake Paul and Tommy Fury are going to be fighting in the boy. Yeah. In March or February. Why did he fight in all these mad places where money. it's real fucking money, man? All this power, yeah. Them, them sheiks over there want to bring sport or boxing to their country. Like, like they're the minister for sport over there. Like, oh yeah, let's invest in boxing, and bring it over here. Like Ronaldo going to else, else, whatever. They're, they're trying to, they're trying I'm to build sure. sport I'm over sure. there, aren't they? They're trying to build it, bring the westernized world over. But I don't know it? if the way of building it is by <coughs> just like throwing mega money at that's what they're doing yeah. they're just going oh yeah it's not Fury, raw like Joshua and Fury yeah we'll give you 200 million they'll never fight they'll never think they'll like, fight no I don't think so no. who do you think wins Fury 100% Fury's the goal Gosh, yeah, isn't he I think so he's the goal think, From so. Where, think he'd be too could, sick yeah huh? think he'd be too I sick I think he does yeah he's too big he's too he's a better but he's just a better skill set of boxing yeah for a heavyweight definitely yeah. he's so quick and he's just Agile See how he moves his feet and how agile he yeah, is for a heavyweight. Like he's, I, I seen him in person and he's like six foot nine or something. He's a monster. Isn't he? he looks more like he. he, he in what are weights? Who who do you like? Would you go up and down to fight people? Yeah, like I won't be. You won't go down. I'd say. Would you go up? I won't go down, but I won't be a lightweight for forever either. So I always say I want to win a world title at lightweight. That's one three five. That's where I am now, and then. Who holds that? The Devin Luby? Haney. Devin you know, Devin Haney. Haney. Course, he yeah. holds them. He holds all the belts. Does so, he? Yeah. So my way has an undisputed champion. 
so, and in other ways, there's five champions. There's a WBC, WBO, WBO, IBF, and WBA. Yeah, there's too many belts. Yeah, there's loads of belts. So can you get, get your hands on one of them? See, that's like Devin if you, Haney if you were in a different way, yeah. You have five chances to win a world title because there's five different champions. No, why don't my yeah. way? You've go up away there and fight the champ and get the belts. I'd rather. I'd like to get the lad at the top of my way first, Haney. I'd like to go there, but he's gonna have Do one fight. He's going to fight Loma in April. Lomachenko? Yeah, and then he's moving up. Haney's moving up. He can't make 125 anymore. So then when he moves up, all them belts go vacant. Will really, he, yeah? Yeah. But that, that's what happens. Can't carry, obviously, can't carry And then there's a ranking. Right? So whoever's one and two in every ranking, why for that belt? Oh, that's going to so be So I have good. to be in a good that's position. A so you have to stay ready for yeah. that. When that happens, when that you happens, have to be boom, ready. Next fight, world title fight or world title eliminator. That's good. That's just exciting. Yeah. I say you're buzzing for all this that. Year this year is hot and heavy yeah. on the government level. Mad, that is my age, man. Fast. Yeah, I was just writing goals last week and I was like, fucking hell. Like, how many goals are like, every year I'm getting closer. a little bit closer to it. Like, and every year I'm like, geez, this year is exciting. And then I look at my goals for this year compared to last year. I'm like, oh, fuck. That's yeah, the, what the fuck? It's a savage feeling already. Really. You know I mean? Who, in, say, just for the Crow Park, who would you like it to be? If to not fight? giving that in a way, like just There's been talk of uh Jorge Linares for that one. Do you follow him? Do you no, know? Him? Bro, I don't he follow fought him. uh I'll have to look him up. He was world champion for a few years. He what fought Lomachenko, he fought Haney, he fought Devin Haney. Lost How did he get on with Haney? Obviously he lost, lost on did points. He, he rocked points? Haney in the ninth round, he walked him back to his corner. To watch that later like, on yeah. to me. So he, he hit him with a backhand on the bell. And Haney's legs went and he actually grabbed him and walked him back to his corner and then walked to his corner. Oh, man. Um, like, Linares is a... He's a legend of my generation, like. Do you know what I mean? I would have grown up even watching him. He's probably 37 now, like. I so. probably know his face. And I don't have okay, probably Linares, I say I probably know. know his face, yeah. Um, but they're talking to him. So, my plan for it is Haney fights Lomachenko in April, moves up, scatters the belts. I'm in a position there where I, Gary and... Linares for whatever belt. Whatever belt. To take oh, any of them. Take any of them. Win a world title. What about... Could, is your man, your man that fought Ryan Garcia, Campbell? Could you, Campbell? Could, yeah, could you fight him? He's retired now. What is he? Yeah, he retired Why after. is he? He can't be that old, He is won he? the Olympics in 2012. Wow, so he looks he young. Doesn't yeah, he look he's young? a baby face. It's a baby he? face, yeah. yeah. I would have watched a lot of him. He's tall, southpaw as well. Kind of similar style <coughs> to himself, yeah. but I fight a little bit more than he does. Yeah, he's a uh, he cl- clinches he and stuff. Doesn't box he? and he boxes a lot. Like I like to fight a little bit more. Than Brawler. Like, yeah, small bit. Like grew up in on the streets of Sarto, you know. In the streets of where? Sarto. Up in nice. nice. Yeah, so. So nice I know he grew up yeah, on the streets on the way to school. It's the nice ball, a time cap- uh, capsule. Yeah. I heard that. I don't know it if is, that's yeah. true. It's, what? There is yeah, a look there's look. a little yoke on it, a little like uh, like a handle that you could open it, like a door. Like you look it up. It? No, I've never. Like, never seen. It's on a roundabout, so you'd have to it'd be a lot of effort to like. There's a lot of roundabouts today. Pull. Out. <laughs> it's it's not ever seen the pictures. Not we've seen the ball multiple times. No, it's not ever seen the pictures of people putting stuff in it. No, what would really? you put? What would yeah, you put it in is it? True. What would you put in it? Is right. What would you? What, what, every that's a good question. Years, what would you put in it? I know what I put in it. I know what I put in it. A picture of me. <laughs> Why we and have loads already? And this is something on it. If I used to open it, if I used to, dare to open it, <laughs> Sony Ericsson Walkman phone. That's what I put into it. Boy, oh, so now I put Sony Ericsson though. Do you know the Walkman? Oh, a walk. Sony Ericsson Walkman. Walkman yeah. Sorry, sorry. I thought it was about the phones. Yeah, well, Walkman. The Sony Ericsson Walkman phones. Was that actually called that? Yeah, it was called. Was that Sony black Ericsson. and orange? Yeah. yeah, with their button, button in the middle, yeah. Yeah. and yeah. they have bounce on it. Yeah, what a game! Remember Everybody the, had one. Do you remember the cheese? Remember the blackberry you came out then? Oh, you didn't get a blackberry. Remember I Sagums? I never had Sagums. a blackberry. No, either. we stayed Sony Ericsson. Oh, you had a blackberry. Oh, yeah, oh, you did. You had BBM then and all, yeah. No, I was jealous. I was quite jealous. I was. Yeah. What, we, what age are you, bro? 26? 26, yeah. yeah I'm still you? 28, bro. What age are you? 26. You went blackberry. That's why I didn't knuckle you. Why are you laughing? Yeah, I am. Yeah, yeah 26. Yeah, yeah. 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 I didn't knuckle you because you went to blackberry. We stood to Sony Ericsson. Yeah. Yeah. We, we, we had we had bounce, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. We had both. I had there both, but oh, I just really upgraded. missed that. Loads of money. No, nah, but I just upgraded then <laughs> to blackberry. I actually got a blackberry off me auntie. Me auntie gave it to me. What? Was it a Nokia or was it a Sony Ericsson? Remember the one where you could make your own case? Yeah, I remember that. The, Nokia, had, the ones that had the the double num the double numbers the the Nokia the, the button. The button. No, I remember the one numbers. that had the lights on the side. That is that one, yeah. It's oh. like a long skinny one. <laughs> yeah. 
What? Well, I used to have a phone they call it a builder's phone you could throw it up in the air like yeah a little JCB yeah and let it bounce off the ground yeah Anton Bourne used to have one and he fucked off the scaffold and it bounced all the way nearly across the street not a bother you go and get it and <laughs> you go and get it and it's there sure Nokia's are good for open bottles you know Nokia's are I remember there was a fella around yeah, the corner yeah, yeah. fella remember the 32 is it what is that what they were called 3210 Nokia 3210 yeah, yeah. yeah yeah there was a, fe- a fella around the corner had a shed a shed full of the cases that used to go on the back of them Say, Only in Jobstown would you get a fella with a shed full of cases for him. Yeah, genuinely, yeah. yeah, and he, he had loud, he had loud of Man United ones, and all. He was buzzing. I was oh, like, oh, way in way in on the genuinely, yeah. I was going down fucking Delhi. You got one, who, wants, who wants Liverpool ones? <laughs> oh, see, so you, <laughs> you rob, you robbed the robber yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, basically, yeah. You're, that, the, you're the lowest. That's how we got his upgrade to the Blackberry. Then, <laughs> so <laughs> so yeah. all the Nokia covers. Yeah, I love to get a blue Blackberry now next week. The tattoos, yeah. That I think that's what makes you stand out as well. Not yeah. as well as you're finding your. T- I think your tattoos are deadly, especially that the one of the car. That's one of the newest ones, yeah. That's a savage. One. Yeah. Did you say, start off the same way getting tattoos that mean something, and then you just went about it? Oh, you got my <laughs> first tattoo was. I always thought I'd have loads of tattoos. I always mm. liked them, but my first one was uh, I have one on my back cross and hands for all your beads. I don't know oh how I feel about back me. tattoos. <laughs> you swear. don't have a do, yeah. Do you? yeah, only God can judge me and it's a cross and two packs of your beads. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the lyrics of his <laughs> favourite two packs of your beads. That's mad random. I've done over on a family holiday in Spain. <laughs> Polly <laughs> Hoyland texts me there, boys, after talking about him. Yeah? He got, he got a five here, does he? I'll, no, I'll hear the message where he says, Where's me boxing gear and me money? <laughs> <laughs> you hungry cunt. <laughs> I got okay. your points, you prick. <laughs> I still have his uh, dick guard and his shorts on t- top. When was that fight? That was a couple of... First of December. Yeah, I have to oh, say, though, there was a there. fucking... What is it? MTK fight? Is that what's called? What's it called? K1. K1, yeah, sorry. <laughs> and, uh, what is MTK, boys? It just shows, yeah. yeah. It was a management company. And, yeah. And MTK was that team. Well, who said MTK at the fight? Me. Then? He said it at the start. At the start. Oh, sorry, yeah. I so, that, what I, is that fight that was in it? K1. K1. Boy, so the, what was with that kick? Oh, I should have seen it. Should have seen it. show you after this. Oh, yeah. my God. Head the, kick goes low. And boom, swings the up. The place went yeah, Boy, you could. And this, was just, this, was a, this was just a charity match. And he's oh, was it? <laughs> <laughs> the ref, the ref was an MMA ref or something, wasn't he? <laughs> he was out. He, he was out of the flow. Gym. So he, he caught. It was, it was around here, was it? Yeah. It was down in Bluebell. Down uh, in Bluebell. Yeah. Club. Oh, and your man, your man just stood there. Hit him, and your man just stood there and blew it. And he said, "Yeah, no." Nah. And your man was like, "I'm grand." Yeah, but then the boys like didn't wear head, head guards or nothing. Didn't wear an. They were. Prof- I think they were professionals. <laughs> they think or that you think? No, they think they said they were going they professionals. Didn't head, they didn't wear guys. They wore them um, gladiator shin pads. <laughs> oh yeah, the big huge, shin pads, big huge head. jokes, big leg pads. Yeah, I know the ones. And they, they had that's all they had on. They were milling each other. That's milling all. each other. What the fuck? Yeah, man. There were some mismatches in there. It was mad. We'll show. You, yeah, we'll have to show you yeah, the video. I need to see that video because <laughs> the place went quiet. Would you ever do uh, not like a, obviously down the line in your career, like fight a YouTuber? Say, yeah, like depends for money. on the money, like yeah, it? like it's Mo- co- money, like, is, money is everything. Money talks, like true, yeah. Yeah. For especially in my game, like people, yeah, yeah, yeah. I seen a, I was listening to a podcast last week, Sean O'Malley. I love Sean O'Malley. You know, Sean O'Malley, Course, yeah. yeah, Sugar Show. Like he was saying, Show if, Show. If all people want about him fighting a rank guy for ages, yeah, yeah. And he's like, yeah, no. And problem. he go into busted. I have a, I have a contract with the UFC, and if they tell me to fight a rank guy. No problem with fight around good. But if you're going to offer fights. me number fifteen in the in division for the same money, or you're going to offer me number three, like I'm going to take number fifteen. Of course, and all makes that. sense. Why not? Give me like, the cash. Yeah, like do you know what I mean. But I get at, at at a certain point, like if you if you have aspirations and you want titles and you want legacy and stuff, you do have to take on them. But you have to. Do you think he's just on the? Do you think he's just, the, he's just uh, Amali himself? I think he's just on the edge of becoming like a superstar. Yeah, I think he can be like he's got the personality definitely, oh, yeah. and then yeah. people were kind of questioning whether he had the skills for a while, but he Boy, seems to have them too. He yeah. can sleep people. Yeah, he's good. He? I like him. He's good stand up as well, isn't he? Yeah, I oh, know. I like him. Him and Adesanya. Adesanya. I like Adesanya. Yeah, I like him too. I think he's there. Uh, he's juicing, is he? Looks like that, doesn't it? Yeah, he says a lot of juice. Going up. Boxing, MMA. 
Everything I think everybody is. does it, but to a certain extent, like off seasons, where they're not in testing pills. Yeah, well, then the uh, McGregor put up a tweet the other week saying he was back in. Yeah, back but ready like, to be just, tested. But, I don't think, <laughs> but I don't think. But I don't think. I don't think people understand. Like McGregor had a broken shin or leg, whatever. Yeah, like oh, he had to go actually, on. He had to go on some stuff sort like of that. Steroids, yeah, some sort of like, regardless. And then said, "Fuck it, give me the juice. Yeah, give me that." He's fucking massive, isn't he? He's. Boys, he is a shit house. You yeah, can't. You, you have man. to say there's nothing better than a McGregor fight week. Build up. Yeah, he brought some entertainment, didn't he? Like, yeah, he did. Staying you're gonna be at that man. stage where we're gonna be oh, buzzing. Staying up for this. Bringing like, I remember McGregor used to like <coughs> mates be getting like credit union loans and all go over to Vegas. Especially what? Vegas, yeah. like, oh, you've heard loads of yeah. people like that, yeah. yeah you paid so, them all back. I don't know. To pay back. I'll be definitely dead. not. But I hope McGregor paid them back. I hope McGregor. Here, what about the back, people yeah. fucking getting loans off to problem to go over? Are we yeah. gonna have to go to Credit Union to see you now and to Crow Park? He was a blow up by that time. In the yeah, hundred percent. And we be get there. This, get this podcast launched. Boom. We're gonna be in there. We've been in the, the, the front row. Why be ready to bring out the the ring cards like that? No way. I'm gonna be sitting at the table talking on a mic saying, "Here he is now. He's coming down there. Bam, yeah. bam. He's yeah. Here's Gary now. He's just walking out there. Why has he got <laughs> pink shorts on? I just don't get it. Is it hard <laughs> to pick a uh, walkout song? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We thought it was hard. Well, you have to have a different one all the time. <laughs> Not no, really. you don't have to. But Not really. Every every camp I have, I listen to kind of different playlists and all. Or I'll, oh, if yeah. I start like I'm big into my music, yeah. so if I start rappers. listening to different, yeah, rappers and all. If I start listening to different music. Then that's in my playlist for say that fight camp. And that's just what gets you going. And then I'm like, right, I've heard that all the time in the gym when I'm fucking pushing hard. So this is what I want to, yeah, to yeah. walk who out. Who would you? Who would you? Uh, more American rappers or English? Yeah, uh, I like I like the UK scene. I was on like the grime. Yeah, I was on uh, like Dave and all. Dave, Fredo, for ages. Um, Central C. I like Central C. I like still BC. like him. Like, see, he's signing for Drake's company. Drake's uh, OVO is it? Yeah, something like that. Is he? Yeah. yeah. Seen that yesterday. But, uh, nah, the American scene is what I'm into. I'm into little baby. Uh, yeah, he's good. Kevin Gates. Listen to Kevin Gates. Oh, that's that mad cunt with the feather over his head, yeah. is it? Yeah. Kevin Gates. I don't really listen to his music, yeah, but I watched cool, a few man. things he was all on. The, he's into spiritual talk and yeah, all that. Yeah. He's he's a mad voice. Um, he's got some good music, so I listen to him. Um, that makes sense, though. In fairness, though, doesn't it? Yeah. Listening to something that had you had you pushing that like when you're in the gym when you're pushing yeah, hard yeah, yeah. in camp then you it, you it's make like, sure remember it's you know like I mean? muscle memory in a way, isn't it? Yeah. It gets you, well, it's it's it gets you in your flow or in your zone. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. I, mean? I would have been like, like music would have been a big influence on me yeah, even yeah. growing like from you are big into like Eminem or at least yeah. Eminem. Looks good there, doesn't it? You sponsored by them? Yeah, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks to Bulmers and Jameson for uh, sponsoring this episode. And always drink aware, people. Can't really say it, but yeah, drink aware. Drink aware. Get the facts straight. Don't drink and drive. Stay alive. That's that's oh, a good saying. Yeah, I just made that up. Listen. That was brilliant, wasn't it? Yeah, it was actually. <laughs> <laughs> do you do that every week, no? Huh? Do you do that every <laughs> week? This is before. And listen, as we said earlier, sleep is healed, folks. Yeah. We are also sponsored by Brennan's. We'd like to thank <laughs> Brennan's today. <laughs> today. You know, you know, we're more closer to mushrooms yep. than we are to apes. Yep. Isn't that mad? You yep. obviously seen what? that same cliff. Yeah, I, I, I see. Did you ever see the video of them when they put the put the cords on them and no. they start singing to each other? Or not? No. Oh, I did the see that. Oh, I, I did see, see that. that. Oh, you have to show me that. Yeah, I did yeah. see that. Like, yeah. I just Mushroom. Uh, there's a program about it on Netflix how they talk to each other yeah, yeah. Like, really off. yeah I swear I what, watched like, it only the other week well like the fucking Navajo. Remi- that reminded me of something like Avatar that video oh, yeah, Avatar. didn't it that's what it's like that's what, what it's like what is that shit called do you have any inspirational words for people that want to get into a gym but just are scared <laughs> don't want to get into the gym or they want to join start boxing just do it innit? just do it like yeah I think the first step isn't it it's the biggest step as well once you do it like everybody gets well, we, I'm like I'm like I said to you earlier on hanging around in that in the gym and they yeah, yeah. you'll have to come up and do an old training session. Hundred percent, just may pop up. It's only up the road as well. Yeah. But all my mates are there. They're all coaches. My mate owns it. Like so, I know what one. You of have their, to run the place. One of their biggest things is gym nerves. Like people that are scared it's to go to the gym, gym and get gym anxious gym. and all. And I've just been around gyms for my whole life, so I'm like, 
why the fuck would you be nervous for a gym but you have people, introvert people that wouldn't and just to think like if you're so self conscious that you think like if I'm in the gym I'm doing my thing I, I don't care about the person beside me but people are self conscious and think that yeah. you so, do and I've been in that position before at 16 going into a gym where I'm the skinny one like yeah. do you know what I mean and going, we had that as well you're looking at me like when, uh, when I was skinny as fuck like three four years ago going into a gym I say to myself, ah, oh, lads, and be trying to wear tighter tops now. Yeah, and you see big fellas yeah. in there, and you're going, fuck it, why Mate, am I even in here? Exactly. Like, do you know what I mean? But the so people you get, do, that's a real thing. Like, but it is. I think the first step is, the biggest step is just doing it. Just, yeah. just go and do it. You get your, you get your first date, and especially you now with the gym that I'm in, and nice, it's, people say it's the most welcoming gym. Once they, it's just, the trick is, in that gym, get somebody in the door once, like, you come in the door once, you won't leave. Like, yeah, you know what deadly. I mean? That's what you uh, want—a good friendly environment, yeah, exactly. around Welcome and good it. trainers. You train with, with Pete. Don't you? Train, train with Pete as well, yeah. He, he saw, what's a, what happened to his uh, legs? Or some, uh, I seen he was, was in a, like, a cast or something. Full cast. Somebody tried to snatch his watch when he was on holidays. Fuck off! Yeah, I didn't know that story. Get it back. He tried to chase them and get it back. And he fell or something. And he fell or was going down like <coughs> steps, doing down steps. Was going down steps. Lord, was we trying to get around, you're so. saying to get Pete on a long time ago? Yeah, Where did you ever contact him? No, yeah. I was texting him. Yeah, say you come on or not. He, I think he did say he will come on at some stage. Yes. That was la- that was probably mid well, last trained, year. Trained with Katie Taylor there the other day, didn't you? Yeah, last, last week. week. Well, that was in between. She's, she's a goat, isn't she, man? She's, she's stiff and gravy. Unbelievable. She she's ki- doing. She's kill everybody. She's doing like what everybody is seeing in the last. Two, three years, four years, whatever. She's doing she's that. Been, that f- I'm boxing like 20 years and she's doing that the last 15 years for me. Like, do you know what I mean? Winning European. I remember she was like five time European champion and four time world champion when I was like 16 or something. Jokes. Like, Holy Jesus. Like, like that's what, mad, isn't she, it? Who do you want her to fight? Obviously, do you want to try and get a fucking or a rematch at a man Serrano. Serrano. Yeah. But that was a great fight. That wasn't, wasn't it. That was that was vicious, that, boys. That they just they did not back banging. away. Me too. Yeah. Just yeah. Katie loves a war. Come on, me just hit each other till someone falls. She's so slick, isn't she? Yeah. Oh man, she's yeah. unreal. Yeah. I love watching her fight. She's sense. always entertaining as well, yeah. isn't yeah, she? Yeah, yeah. Probably I always she's think not a little a, bit too much because she's not she, a knockout artist, but she go. Do you know what? If Katie decided, like half the half the opponent she boxed, if she decided, I'm just gonna box the head off these for ten rounds and not let them hit me. She, she could. could do that, like, but she just gets too involved, and you yeah, get caught yeah. one shot, and you go, yeah. "Fuck this!" Thing. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's hard not to do that. But but Katie, we will have you on here one day, hundred percent. One day, she'll one be day. On, yeah. yeah. Pray to God. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> <laughs> you Muslim, yeah. <laughs> our new friends are Muslim. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so it's all right to say. Try any train partners like that. You think that are gonna be savage, like gonna make a good that I train with that, yeah I train with uh, a girl in Unit 3 then Nace um, she's actually entering the elites next week the Nationals Kelsey Leonard so she's trying to qualify for the Olympics um, does elites actually are coming soon aren't they the elites are in, I think she's weighing in next week 10 days or something so is she really light is she foreigner. she's 57 kilo she's fine now. Um, so she's got a couple of years left obviously she's trying to qualify for the Olympics so that goes well then next Olympics are what 24 and then she mm. could be she there could be from the way. lads in from the lads in uh, in Dublin in the gym Paul Ryan is I don't know if he's now Paul Ryan it is no. Paul Ryan. he's from out uh, Kulak area no see it's I don't area. really know much from Northside um, he's 5-0 is he yeah so, yeah um, knocking everybody out just hasn't got his what's your man Emma something is it Emma Brennan yeah town. he's good is he yeah I haven't seen the uh, wouldn't much of him Emmett was in the Olympics wasn't he 2020 yeah. 2021 Wait, yeah, he's, he says he's turning over now what's that um, mean turning over to pro oh. he's going amateur to pro like. yeah um, but yeah so who would all these people be signing with though that's the thing like who's the big man it's Frank Warren or it's Matchroom boxing isn't Frank it Frank Warren or Matchroom there's a couple of like small hall scenes around Ireland and that like Irish boxing do shows uh, or Love Irish Boxing or something it's called um, Mark Dunlop does shows in Belfast Right. there's a guy I went to a show just before Christmas there in the stadium there's somebody after coming I think it's called Elite Sports Promotions or something they're starting to try and run shows there. Yeah, we haven't had proper boxing down here in years like Bernard Dunn Bernard Dunn back in the fucking hunky dories 15 years ago that was yeah 
anytime someone says Bernard Dunn, I just think Hunky Dory's. I don't know why <laughs> yeah. it is, let's <laughs> Hunky Dory Fight Nights, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it was. wasn't it? It wasn't yeah, it Friday yeah. Nights from Hunky Dory's. I hope so. you made a few quid off that. Uh, if, if somebody's oh, saying your name and they just yeah. Hunky Dory comes yeah. to mind. Literally, everything is all Hunky Dory, baby. Everything is Hunky but Dory, boys. That's it. You're going to be slaughtering three lads this year. Yeah. And you're going to be champion 2024. Over to America. Yeah. Start yeah. Oi, taking on them. Don't go tree arena. Go America in October. And we Do tree arena and we'll all go and scream. I mean, get backstage down. passes and all. You go tree arena, <laughs> headline the tree arena, and then if it was a, like a thousand Ryan people, Garcia. if it was a thousand people that was going to come to America, there were 10,000 people that were going to come. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, true. You go, you go, Ryan Garcia. You have to home, but homegrown fan base, and then you know what I mean, yeah, because yeah. and uh, like other countries don't really, but Irish, we actually do travel. Yeah, we do. We're, we're the best travel fans. Other, we're like, the best travel right? fans in the world. Hundred yeah. percent. People don't like. I don't think people see that enough or believe that enough. But, oh, and here, like, ole, 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 yeah. Would you ever just get an open top bus for the crack? <laughs> You know, oh, we were gonna do it for winning the cup last year. I won uh, Europeans, them ones we were talking about earlier on, and I had to get in the back of a like a truck. To, I was getting a, an award off Nice Town Council, so the town hall in Nice, I had to you get had the key for the an open top truck from what, like the St. Paddy's parade? Yeah, but it was just me in the truck. Which and boxing girl was playing. Oh. <laughs> and I was sixteen, seventeen, Love it. from the boxing club in Nice to the town hall. Me standing in it. Where you shadow yeah. boxing and all oh, that. horrible. It Did was, you shadow boxing? I say you were cringing, were you? It was the worst moment. I hate, I hate <laughs> stuff like, Somebody put up an interview from when I was 17 on Instagram yesterday and uh, I showed it to me missus last night. I was like, look Were you cringing? She, oh my God. Oh, but cringe. Like, people always say to me you now when I'm getting interviewed after fights or just interviews in general, oh, you, you speak well, like you're not bad in front of a camera. Yeah. But, like I was thrown in front of a camera when I was 17 because I won that tournament and I had to deal with it then, do you know what I mean? It was shy at yeah, yeah. So I'm glad now because now I see lads who's 24, 25 and you're in front of a camera for your first time. Yeah, and they're you stuttering. Know, and they're stuttering like fuck. Stuttering and they're scuttering. Yeah. But yeah. we have a little question, a little, a little funny question, right? If you're in a bar fight, yeah? Yeah. And you got to pick four guys with you to help you. It's a big fight. It is. You're in a bar. Bar brawl. The bar five, brawl. Five against one. Was that with you? Yeah, five against one. Or is that five of them as well? It's going to be five. It's going to be more oh, than five. You're in a, many, what blade bars are you going to? There's only five lads in it. Who would I pick? Who would you pick? So me and four more. Yeah. Now just remember, he lifted past, the fella twice my presence. size. Just remember that, yeah? <laughs> that fella was twice my size. <laughs> <laughs> what do you reckon he weighed? Definitely 140 pounds. <laughs> 140 pounds? I, I can't do pounds. That's the KG, man. He's divided yeah. by 2.2. That's how you do it. You, you can't not gonna do that either. Yeah, just... I do want the calculator. <laughs> <laughs> oh, who would I have, though? You, you, th- you think as well. Mike boys. Tyson. Mike Tyson myself who was the last time uh, Nganu Nganu and Usman oh that's a good one that's versus good. who would be a my bar brawlers I'd have Chuck Liddell Batista uh John Jones and myself. That's it, isn't more. it? One more. One more. Oh, one more, do we? You don't need one more. I'll do one more. I'd say uh, Vince McMahon <laughs> in the front. That's a show you want. <laughs> 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 Vince McMahon. <laughs> but you're in the bra, he's coming down like that. <laughs> and he's saying to you, what? <laughs> Big <Pretty> chest. With the mic. Mike selling time to her. I know he changed it to Mick Foley. He'll go through the milk. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. Right. And I, I, right. And I said, McGregor, Kimbo Slice, yeah, nice. The Rock, yeah, nice. And Kevin from Home Alone. Right, that's a good one. Right, we, 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 yeah. let, we let you yeah. pick. Right, okay. yeah. Kev, fair enough to. You. But um, it's a great, <laughs> it's a great pick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you oh, think my one wins? 
No, you you was good on. I think I shouldn't have picked the, I'm, I'm changing Batista <laughs> He's getting ready no, to get you hit can't, No you picked him now He's here and all He's at the door waiting Ticket but in his hand But Brian Batista When he had the black jocks on him <laughs> 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 Honest to God boys When he's giving people that Fuck it what was, what was it called Batista, Batista bomb Batista bomb, bomb yeah. yeah Change it sorry No he's gone You know who it is Brock Lesnar he got killed in the UFC fight as well, didn't he? Yeah, yeah he Frank did. Mer- yeah. Frank Mer- Frank Mer- he, it was a double though. I think he bet him and he lost. Did he only have two fights? No, we, no, them two had two fights. I think. Did Brock Lesnar have more? I, did, I think he had. Like, he slept a couple of cunts. Did he? Yeah, he's big. Who's though, the other fella in a uh, UFC that's going on Bain Evan? The big fat fella. Oh, that's very vague. Very vague. No, uh, he has like he has like a mullet and a fucking ginger beard. He's a hillbilly or something. Are you talking about big country? Yeah, he's not. He's not he, hasn't, he hasn't been in that in ages, man. WWE, no? Roy Nelson. Roy Nelson. Roy Nelson. Roy Nelson, yeah, him. Yeah, he's not in anymore. Is he not? No, he's retired about a year. <laughs> oh, because I was back to the boxing here now for a few minutes before we end this. <laughs> so, yeah. you're saying. <laughs> We have three fights this year are going to be majorly big for yourself and you're going to win all three. Yeah. Yeah. And I, I'd actually you would like to see you go on a big brawl, 12 rounds, boom. As I say, there's a lot of people questioning you, saying, oh, he can't do it. That's the thing as well. Boy, I it's hope you just keep blocking like, people out. So do I, to be honest with you. So do I. Fuck it's that quick 12 rounds, rounds man. Getting... I don't want to do 12 rounds. No. Don't have That's what he's saying. Rounds. You can go to walk, Come home, but you have a chance of going home early. Go home at 7 o'clock. I'll go home all day at 7 yeah. o'clock. 100%. But then it's it's a little bit like I know what I can do because I do it in the gym every day yeah. and I'm sparring and I'm yeah. doing it and the people who know me closest or watch me train them will know that I can do it but like when you see me fight then boom all of a sudden it's over. I'm like back to the change I'm half disappointed going like people didn't see half your not, skill set. Yeah. Put, like showed anything of what I can do. Like, is there any yeah, spars that yeah. you've got that have Put you to the test, like is any like not just Irish people. In the our spars in the gym are like we go at it in the gym. Well, any time we spar, a spar is a fight to me. Like do you know what I mean? Because you're preparing for a fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't spar. Outside. You don't like spar. I don't oh. spar. I don't like spar. Well, like I'll do like school and drills or. And we go like. Like yeah, if I spared you, I wouldn't be taking the piss. Yeah. Like I've spared me. You would take. The, you wouldn't. wouldn't be taking the piss. So you'd no, knock me straight out. Liberties. No, no, like I wouldn't take the piss as in. No, I'd like you to take the piss, so you don't kill me. But that's yeah. I mean, I, I would take the piss. Alright, sure. So I mean, I'd, I'd show you. We do it Sunday. We had somebody up just on before that me. happened, and some. Uh, some 17, 16, 17 year old come up to the gym, one of the lads brought him up to the gym, he was like, he's an amateur and was going for Irish championships or something. I was sparring, I was getting ready for a fight, I was three weeks out, I sparred six rounds and he says, do you mind if this young fella jumps in for two rounds? I was like, no bother, yeah, but. I'm going hell for that. No, it wasn't even, I'll teach him, like, I'll show him a couple of things. So the first round passed and I was just moving my head, I didn't throw a punch in the whole first round and uh, went back to the corner and Pete said to me, just throw a jab throwing our job like give him something to think about get him to move his head or whatever and the start of the second round he said something like oh I thought you were this or I thought you were that like the young fella he did. said that to you he said to me yeah <laughs> and I was only three weeks out from a fight and this was going into me eighth round of sparring I was just Why doing this young fella like a favour yeah. yeah. and I actually nearly grabbed him by the throat with me glove I had my glove on and I had him and I was like Way, yeah. yeah the round that started like the round technically started pizza at time and I had him like that and then Pete said, Pete called time four or five times, and I just kept hitting him in the back of the head. He was up, and I was like, If you <laughs> ever come into, don't ever come into my gym and do that again. I'm trying to help you out. Like, yeah, I'm trying to do you a favour. Like, if I've, I've often had spars like that, where like I could spar you now, and we could spar six rounds, and you'd learn loads, and no one would get hurt. But if you try and take the piss, like, I've had people where you're trying to you're trying Show to teach them, them and, 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 they, and then they take the piss like they try and knock you out or something. Like, oh, you know what I mean? is that what you mean? Take the piss like they're not doing little dances. No, like that. take the piss as in go on hell for leather. Yeah, go on hell for leather, and you're like, right. If you want to go to that, then I'm gonna do that. But I'm trying to fucking yeah. get you a valuable yeah, spar yeah, that you can yeah, learn yeah. from. Like, do you know what I mean? Yeah. But, right, Trump. Yeah. But if, like if you want to spar me, you can just go normal. Like you don't have to. Like 100% no, I, I'd yeah. like to bring monks you up because I feel like we do this with all like uh, fighters that we do get on. We have to get like a body shot. 
Oh, have you? Body shot. Yeah? Oh, yeah. you were still there? Yeah. Oh, I took a few body shots. Yeah, yeah but he put the pads on. Who did on. you just have on? So fast. Dylan Moran, we took a body shot off Dylan. I took a body shot off Padjo Hoyland. If you don't, probably don't remember him. I know Padjo, yeah. Yeah, Padjo. Beast. Paulie, you took Paulie, Eddie. Dean, did we take one off Dean? Party as well? No? No, actually, I don't think we did off him. Well, you're next. Let's take one off you. Obviously not now, because we don't want you to hold your hands, because your hands... Yeah. I would feel quit. Yeah, well, yeah, you listen, should, like, the camera's here now, so, like, if you want to do it now, lads. Yeah, he'll do it now. I'll, I'll watch. Really? I'll watch us, yeah? I'll sit back here and watch what's going on. Oh, good luck. Don't go out there, don't be a... I was watching this just like tense, Papa. No, just... Loose. Don't tense, you push it up again, tense. You push it all out, you're throat, loosey-goosey. You oh, shit yourself if you tense. I like to push it out, yeah. Oh, right? Nice one. Are you said that? Boys, I actually wish it myself, no, no. Did I hit you there? You got me there, you got me there. Go again. What again? Like, no, go. He, I don't. I mean, no, he only went about. Yeah, He only went twenty percent. Did it go about seventy? That was seventy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, fair play. Fair play. Uh. I'll take zero percent. Who could that was? Look at this. Look at the red face. Look at Ellen Fairness. Oh, good look. But here, yeah, there. Do you know That's why some people are built different, guys. Okay. <laughs> So but, was, that's actually something that we notice now at our like now watching boxing and uh, and doing the, the little bit of training with them yeah we done a little body shot yoke didn't we yeah you wouldn't know like you wouldn't don't realise how much a body shot would do to you oh, like, body shots body shots ones. are the best body they? shot is a worse than a headshot <laughs> like genuinely wow. I don't know what I'd do to you like fuck it you really right 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 body shot I'd rather get hit with 10 headshots than a body oh, shot fuck that boys like Jesus Christ yeah your stomach is literally yeah. falling out your arse yeah. like, you know what I mean yeah. oh it's horrible and then you never see lads go on the ground I've been Touch wood, lads, yeah. I haven't been... That's ever, all wood, dear. That's, you, that's all homemade. Is it, yeah? Yeah. Like, deadly. I haven't been ever uh, hit with one where, like, I've seen lads rolling around the floor. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. For, like, could, you could be five, yeah. ten minutes on the floor. Like, that's bad. Here, <laughs> solarplex, <laughs> you know, that was. That was solarplex, yeah. <laughs> what a killer. That's brilliant. But it's content, guys. Yeah, did, I content. did this for years. Delighted. Boys, I'm doing for it. After that now. Crap. <laughs> <laughs> but, Gary. Yeah, we'll brother, wrap it up anyways. We'll wrap what you up. are we night in two hours? Yeah, two hours. And all our, all our people that watch us and follow us, make sure you go and follow Gary. Yeah, all his platforms. TikTok. Journey. Anybody who's clicking on here because you follow me, Make sure you follow make the sure lads. you follow back. Love that. And we all help each other. And do you know what? Do you know why? Because it goes round and round about. Swings. Full circle movement. It is. <laughs> and you know what? Oh, oh, Christ. <laughs> See, there's difference, people. You have monks here, and then you have me. Fresh and well. <laughs> oh, that was no, I always get that when I put my socks on. Do you ever get your hips locked when you put your socks on? You'll oh, help understand. Legs, legs, you've, it, yeah. It's sore, isn't it? I can't even put my socks on. Isn't it sore? Yeah. We've, put my we're, socks on my mouth. That's we so have the long out. leg syndrome, so we're... Like, you know, when you're close, that's sore. Yeah, hip flexor. Yeah, hip flexor. Is that what it is? Yeah. Well, you stretch me leg. Even that, dude, that was sore. Yeah. It was sore. But, uh, yeah, anyways, fucking... Uh, lads, Both. thanks for having me up. No. Yeah, 100%. It was fun having a chat. It was nice meeting you as well. And I can't wait and to see you fight again. To be honest, and I'm going to be, we're gonna be at the them. journey, just unfold. Because yeah. we know you now, and then when on a you're personal mega level. famous now, we'll say, man, we had that fella in our gaff. It was madness. 100%. This 100%. isn't a gaff, this is a studio, bro. This is a studio, yeah. It's a home. Come back to the studio as well. Yeah, 100%, yeah. yeah. Have to come oh, back. but you know what we'll do on your next fight? We'll do a watch along. 100%. I know, because I want to be at it. It's going to be in Ireland, isn't it? To watch, oh, watch along as in. Yeah. No, fuck that, should we be at it? Yeah, next it's only in Ireland. Next one will be UK, and then after that. Alright, so it'll be no watch along in the UK one. 
the UK one, and yeah. then we watch the one in Ireland. Yeah. Yeah. We'll come to the one in Ireland. Make a big banner. Yeah. Can you? Will you throw me your shorts, please? Throw you them? Yeah. Take yeah. them off and throw them. It could be mid for you if you want. Like. <laughs> <laughs> it could be before, mid, after. That's a bit of a mad face that's to a, have, isn't that's it? That's a bit fruity. What shorts? Yeah, just to be having... Oh, did you get a clip of that? What? Of me getting a box? Or do I have to again? No. Oh, good. That's I didn't we, get a clip. We put that on TikTok. TikTok? Isn't it mad that we say, oh, do you remember when TikTok came first out? It was like, we're well, not going near. Yeah, that's I'm for only, kids, I'm man. I'm only on it about, like, I know, recently, yeah. Th- yeah, three weeks, maybe. But, like, I would have been always on it, like, scrolling on yeah, it, watching yeah. videos on it, but it's a bit different as well, isn't it? Like, co- the content that you need for Instagram. You want, you want to do a yeah, bit of YouTube different. and stuff, don't you? Yeah, I'm on that as well. What? First video this week on YouTube. Are you going to be doing fight camp type stuff? Yeah, well, this week I just did a QA. and a I put up a question box on my Instagram, and then uh, I'm just answering questions off that for a couple of minutes. I'm going to yeah. take eight or ten of them, but, yeah, I'm going to be doing... Uh, you should. I, I, th- I think anyone that has some sort of, like, that does something... Good and people that like watch like say sports wise definitely use your your training as content 100 percent, but i don't like to show too much of it either for other people to watch yeah, but I get you, you can do certain edits yeah, and all that yeah kind of course, course. Yeah, 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 you yeah. know yourself you know what you're doing yeah, no, but, but yeah people what an episode for yeah, some what an episode for the first one back after the new year one of, the the one, one of your down. goals straight away madness head blown off stomach and bits <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I love the episode I'm delighted that you came on yeah 100% yeah. and Thank we wish, and we wish you well yeah. and brother and as we say if I don't see you through the week I'll see you through the window 100% yeah and keep your head out of the microwave that's it boys and girls magic lads 100% boys